Jetzt. Nagsalita ka, you scared off a viewer. Hello, welcome to, to Gaming Gamers, the show with Gaming Gamers. And this week, we have... River Cruz and Andrin Bernardo. <laughs> yeah. Ron Lemmings Run. <laughs> Did you like that ano, awkward beginning? Na... Yeah, what was that? What music was that for? You, know, you didn't know? Malamang Mr. Podcast video game music over here. Uh, what, what Dragon Quest. Steam the oh! Dragon. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Fuck, yeah. well, I forgot. I, forgot. I played that. Before. I played that because si Koichi Sugiyama. Yung composer oh, ng Dragon oh, Quest. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, he just died. He kicked the dragon bucket. Yeah. He was a, uh, I think he was a staunch denier ng no comfort women sa Philippines. A horrible person. I'm glad he's <laughs> dead. Okay. His music. Oh, it's a river. River. Hey, River. Yo. Hello. Did you see yung beginning ng no, no podcast? Nope. Oh, we played yung Dragon Quest theme. <laughs> uh, the theme song? Yeah, I was just telling him about si Andren about si ano, si Koichi Sugiyama, the denier of atrocities uh, nice occupation. Man. Yeah, Filipino, no uh, Philippine occupation ng uh, Japanese occupation sa Manila. Yes. So, <laughs> fuck him and his. Yeah, he, 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 he thought it, he thought it was a, he thought it was a quest. He thought they were just getting experience points. They're just grinding though. Yeah, I'm better like stabbing bayonets with babies. That's low experience points, buddy. And they're uh, killing babies. <laughs> I think that's just one exp. I mean, that's only uh, one. Yeah. yeah I read. Only... I read an account of the uh, occupation in sa, Batanga City. Na, and I've been wanting to research more on this because I want to do like uh, history of Batanga City. Um, there were so many people killed. Na, a well. Filled up with blood. Ganon kadami sa sa Batangas City. Jesus eh. Christ. Uh -oh. So Soros in Smash, guys. How's your weekend? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Um, how's uh my? Who, 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 I'll go first. I guess I'll go yes, first. Yeah, go ahead. Um, I have uh, rewatched um one of my favorite. Will be blessed. No, no, no. no. <laughs> uh, I watch. I rewatched. Um, what was that? Fuck. My fucking brain is <laughs> fried right now. Uh, fuck, what did I rewatch? I, I actually like that goddamn movie. Oh, here, go Fresh River. I'm sorry. Oh, my Fast God. <laughs> was brain, it Fast and the Furious? No, 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 no. Was it a Who Marvel movie? It? No, 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 no. Not is it that, a no. drama? Oh, fuck. This is not good podcast. American movie. No, 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 no. It's not American? 
No, no, no. I mean, your documentary. Wait, wait, wait. I'll look at my phone. Sige, okay, sige. Go ahead. Uh, sige, I'll, I'll go. Uh, you go ahead. You go. You go. Because I actually don't I'll remember go, what happened my weekend. What? Well, no one remembers. I, well, uh, it doesn't even matter. Like it doesn't. You know, the idea of a weekend in this yeah. post-pandemic world. No, pandemic world. Because it's still ongoing. It's currently, it's yeah. Weekend. So the weekend call. Um, I actually don't remember either. Oh, I finished the. I fucking finished the um, Cena Blade Chronicles. Oh, uh, nice. Tell me I about was, the ending. How do you feel? I was so happy. I I was telling this to Andrew that uh, um, send uh all RPGs, they are friendship simulators. All of the the questing, all of the the battle systems in JRPGs, they are just there to get you to stay long enough to make the friends that you have along the way. Like, I really believe that. I was crying at the end because para Fiora, she got her body back because si Shulk became a god, a literal yeah, god. Yeah, it's a so while. I fucking hate that it's like this <laughs> How'd you feel satellite. about the... It, it had to be... When the solar system showed up and then you, you saw oh, Earth and you saw Jupiter. That I loved was it. Wild. I was like, what the hell? That was, yeah, that was, was beautiful. Oh. That's It's Final Fantasy VIII. <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of similar similar imagery of walking in like the, the stars and stuff um, I do not I guess this is this is my thing I guess the creator of um, Seno series Seno Saga, Seno Blade Seno Gears he's a huge western sci-fi fan because yeah. He used the monolith Saseno Saga. Um, there's a lot of imagery borrowed. So like yung Dito, it's very 2001 yung whole explanation for Oh yeah, for how it started. It's like uh, so Andren, all of this this is just a uh, this is just a story of a scientist who became a god and invented a, a universe. And that's basically yung Seno Blade. Yung yung big reveal. So... Um, like Dr. Manhattan? No, man. Pero lame. Like, okay. not like... A, <laughs> they didn't have the big dick. Yeah. Yeah. I think si Dr. Manhattan is interesting because it's like... Like, imagine yung pinaka smartest person that you know. Like, straight lay scientist. And he just became a stoner. It's like I'm I'm a depressed stoner now. I don't give a shit about anything. But he has all this power. Ganun. Pero dito with like si Sansa and those guys, it's like you're trying too hard. If I was a dude, dito, I'll I'll ask this question to you guys. I'll answer it first. But if I what would you do if you were a god? You know what I would do? I'd take a rest. I'd take a rest. I'd finally feel rested. That's what I would do. But if you're a god, like how does it, that work? Like, my, you're gonna take a rest when people are praying to you. Oh my God, Lord, Lord God, please. Sana hindi mag, sana mawala na yung cancer ng kapatid ko. Yeah. yeah first well, thing I would do if I were God is I'd make us a lesser God that can do my job for me, mm. and then then you know, I, and I I get a secretary, I get an accountant to set That's my crazy. papers right. That's pretty scary. That's that whole idea of like the false god and then the real god. Yung bald. It's that. That's a real thing, diba? There's like yung false. Uh, there's the false creator god, na parang is is the godhead before. So like there's a. Illu- I'm going insane. I want. To, I'm going. <laughs> there, there, there is that. There's that idea. So parang. Yeah, that's true. If you were a. Uh, if you were a Steve Jobs type of god, you'd be like, I'd delegate and then I'll steal your yeah. glory. I'd create Steve Wozniak, yeah. And he'd do all the work <laughs> and then I'd take the credit. I, oh, I, uh, un- unrelated, I watch a lot of gaming YouTubers. Tapos yung, one of these gaming YouTubers got like a message. Because he asked, he said, na, Oh, I wish uh, Scott the Woz, this one other YouTuber, would show up sa aking video. And then your girlfriend you got like a a video from Steve Wozniak. It's the Woz. <laughs> I love Scott the Woz, by the way. He, he's great. Him. Who's he's that? Like, I don't know who that is. He's the he's whitest like, guy ever. Yeah, and he's he's the thing I love about him is he's self-aware that he's yet another YouTuber talking about video games. 
He's basically like a postmodern angry video game nerd. That's what he is. Yeah. 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 Um, I'll talk about my weekend, I suppose. Um, I'll try to think of something that isn't video game related, but I'll think of, I'll say that first, and then I'll think of something after. Um, in terms of video games, I finished yet another Shin Megami Tensei, and at this point, it's just like <laughs> it's just <laughs> it just doesn't have the same sting because like. Diminishing you know, returns. It, it's diminishing returns. It is returns. exactly. It is because like it. It always, it always has this big like. Oh, do you choose chaos or law? If you choose chaos, the demons. You're saying that the demons are equal to humans. If you're saying law, you're subjugating to God's will, and there's no free will anymore. It's the same thing. I just I beat this other one, and the only difference is that you're American instead of Japanese, and you're in Antarctica. And by, by the time I was finished with it, I was like. I should stop playing these games until <laughs> the fifth one comes out. I yes. should just wait a bit. <laughs> Give it a rest, Muna. I want I want River to start playing on the opposite of JRPGs, which is uh maybe like wrestling games or something. Yeah, I just that's not even true because okay, there's role playing or something. <laughs> that's true. Everything is role playing. I can't escape it. Uh, but I I guess um non video game related. I started um, I started watching Kakiguri. It's a oh, Netflix ah, anime. Yeah. It's a great anime. I'm on season two. I'm on episode four or five. It's fantastic, but like Jesus Christ, I love how it kind of reminds me of uh, No Game No Life. Where have you seen that one? Where <laughs> I love the concept and I love the characters to an extent, but there's always that one thing that just makes me feel ashamed of watching it, like in public. <laughs> oh, you come places. <laughs> Yeah, no game, yeah, yeah, exactly. It, oh, yeah, 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 I know the one in No Game No Life. Yeah, go, go over. In No Game No Life, it's literally like incest, like it implied incest. And then in Kakigori, it's like she she gets wet when <laughs> yeah, she gambles. Just starts, I was going, hell yeah, incest. incest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. What's funny? But what's funny? River, like, there's that, that's not a new thing. Not a and, no, exactly. So I, I just what brushed it off. Too. Yeah. Incest <laughs> is the Isn't oldest thing based on the Bible. That's fair. You're right. You're right. Like, I mean, where did where did Abel's wife come from? It's gotta come from either Adam Dude, or Dude, my anime called Orihimo, which is literally just about that. But they're half brother and sister. The, I know. That, so it makes it okay. You, you, if you think like the developer of 12 Minutes uh, is an anime fan, because he just... Remember 12 Minutes with James McAvoy? <laughs> they, oh, I have, he's an I anime don't know fan. Oh, didn't Andrew oh, I thought you were talking it? about the game. Yeah, yeah, I thought you were talking about the game 12 Minutes. Is it 9 Minutes? Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's twelve, oh, it's all 12 minutes. Uh, yeah, where like the probably. twist is incest, and then you're yeah, yeah. <laughs> you think... yeah I think he's an anime fan. That's why he was like, okay. oh, just there. I think the Japanese can pull off incest with anime, or in general, they look well, pure. Okay. If it's like two Americans, it's like ugh. <laughs> in no game, no life. They're technically yeah, you, not you, related. You trust so the age now. It's cartoons, so it make me. It, it's okay if it's cartoons. Uh, Got such a blurry. Anyway, category. Um, it reminds me. It. It's oh wait, like, wait, wait, it... wait. Sorry, oh, sorry. Do you think na yung people watching um old boy who are <laughs> into yung incest anime is like, oh, what a nice surprise. Oh, what a happy. I'm glad this has a happy Ooh! ending. What? <laughs> Everyone's. Well, it's funny because when old boy <laughs> came out, like everyone uh, we watched, that was parang so funny. yung guys. When he was like, oh my god, that's the worst thing. I had a boner. She was so hot. But like, your daughter, no. They're like, young, young girls were like, oh. oh. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> you. Like, your girlfriend, your other girl's like, yes. It's, I think it's it's a sad thing about, yeah, that's a reality. Yeah, for some it's, it's true. Yeah. There's yeah, a that, guy that's yeah. like, oh. Ah. Ew, if that happened to me, I don't know. But <laughs> what was Someone I said, kiss exes. Even I didn't oh, watch that. I know that one. I know that that's one. That garbage. one. Oh, that's freaking. That's Leanne, my partner. She, um, they're commenting. This is oh. anime called Kiss Exes, where it's this. They're sisters, essentially. Anyway. <laughs> oh wait, wait. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go. Um, since we're talking about incest, I started watching like this. Chris, uh, let me see Chris Chan and Renzi on YouTube. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, no. Like I watched this. Video I started watching. I didn't finish because it's too long. But like they are saying that she she might not get um prison time because 
there is no statute for against incest between a mother and a daughter. So where the oh state where, my where God. they're oh. in. So she it's not worded na parang kasama ang ang lesbian daughter mother daughter thing. Jeez. So Christian found the loophole. I, I'm yeah. not saying that well, they deliberately not, transitioned or anything, but like that's awful. <laughs> I don't yeah, like it's that. just it's a horrible, it's a horrible blue situation. Is the warm, it, it, it's blue is the warmest color, milf edition. <laughs> <laughs> that's what the law is called. That's what the actual law is called. <laughs> anyway, it would be hotter if she had sex with her mom. <laughs> Uh, oh, I see. Oh, no, let's, no, no, no. let's get back to uh, something fun. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's yeah, go, ahead. go ahead. Oh, I can hear oh, myself. Can who's, who's echoing? Um, I think it's Josie, baby. I'm, I'm Josie. echoing. So yeah. Um, who who hasn't? Hey, Andrew, did you speak of? Did you talk about your weekend? Oh yeah, I'll talk. I'll talk. What was that movie? Oh okay, yeah, well, um, it was. <laughs> okay, it wasn't actually Hello? a movie. It wasn't actually yeah, a movie. It's it was, fine, yeah, it's fine. Yeah. I'm sorry, it wasn't actually a movie. Uh, I was because like my favorite movie because there have been a lot of Squid Game memes. Yes, you know, uh, and, and I I decided to watch it. I watched the first episode, the one with the uh, what do you call that game where you stop red light, green light, red basically. light, green and light, it's, Pepsi it's Seven. Good, up. and it's good because it talks about society as a whole. And it's unfair, and they have a fair playing ground with it. I liked it the first episode, so Red Dead Redemption episode two. Game is good. I'm, I'm surprised you haven't been spoiled. The fact that you're on Facebook. Oh, believe me, I've been spoiled, but I don't fucking oh, okay. care. Oh, okay. All right, good. <laughs> <And> strong. <laughs> it doesn't care yeah. about. It doesn't really care good. about spoilers. <laughs> Dude, like Giselle was so mad at me because I read the script of Midsommar. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. It's like we arrived to Sinihan because I'm with my friends. Giselle, this is pretty. This is a pretty cool movie. I read the leaked script. <laughs> Watch. Okay, it's it's a totally different thing if you've read it like in your spare time. But the fact that you're in the freaking cinema and you're saying that you've read it, that's a different level. Just, like, oh, you know what he's doing? He's grinding experience points before watching the movie so he really <laughs> understands it. Dude, I, I wanted so badly to tell you, tell you about the bear. Uh, he's going to be burned alive. <laughs> so I'm going to have yeah, I'm gonna have to do that so, so Windows. Um, so, okay. Um, what we were gonna do? <laughs> oh, we can go. We can go. We can yeah, go. Yeah. Um, uh, I also played uh, Tales of Arise. So yeah, um, yeah. last podcast, but we saw na mini Giselle na level forty na ako. That's nasa chapter two. <laughs> <laughs> At seventy hours na. <laughs> oh my lord! I stink, dude. Why are you fucking killing rats and <laughs> goblins? Like, no, I no, because what I said, River. I said I was a river. Like it's yeah. nasa head cannon ko. That the, the adventure is happening real time. And I'm <laughs> okay. like, oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, have you ever watched Cautious yeah. Hero? I've I've heard of it. I know there's this other that's... anime where yeah they kill. There's this one other anime where they kill slime until they're level nine nine nine. I forgot. The name yeah, I've also that. watched them. Yeah, they, so I knew. I, see, you live uh, that. You live that so, life. <laughs> that's why I, I can super relate to that. But with Joselle, the fuck are you doing? So that's a chapter three novel. <laughs> Okay. I would it's hope so. <laughs> what is super interesting about that anime? It talks about racism. Like, they Japaneseify it. I know you Renans are the the Donans are the black people. The Renans are the white people. Okay. They enslave the Donans, and what you do is go to each continent and liberate the people there. So the first one, basic basic ooh, uh, protagonist. Uh, Antagonist who enslaves them. Second one, parang ganon den pero handsomer. Why is it always like that? By the way, you mga <laughs> villains. Like after you defeat a big fat bulky one, you have to f- defeat a posh rich guy. Handsome ones. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And what I love about the third chapter is when you go to the continent, everyone is living harmoniously. Uh, Actually, might be some of a leader, and you feel like an asshole the entire time you're there. Kasi pinipilit mo yung ideals mo sa kanila. And that, yeah. that, that, that but they're actually, living equally. Yeah, okay. but that actually is a good change of pace. Na, oh, I like they're painting. That. Yeah. yeah. Actually, so I'm um, super excited. And I went back to the sub so, the side quests. So nandun na ako sa part where kakalabanin nyo na yung Renan leader na yun. Yeah. 
Hmm. Cool. All right. No, don't spoil it like fully because I do. I actually do want to play this game eventually. Yeah, and, um, what's really great, Palan River, you'll like about this: you get two kinds of experience points. You get oh. you basic vanilla. Twice the grind. XP. Yeah, basic vanilla XP, XP, and you get SP, you skill points, where you can. Because I thought it was sister quest, points when you fuck your sister. <laughs> you get you get halus host points. So, so yeah, so yeah, it's oh, yeah, so the yeah, but SP is for skills or whatever, skills. Like, what? and you unlock different types of skill grids when you complete oh. side quests, and okay. you can pour it into that. So cool. it affects the gameplay okay. in the way that you run faster, you cast spells faster, and when you complete a particular skill grid, you get bonus stats. So I am so obsessed with the fucking mechanics. Okay. It's like Tales yeah. of Graces. It's I love like this game. I love this it's game. like Nino Kuni also, where like the side quests unlock um, things that you can get that you won't other otherwise get if you don't do the side quest. And that sounded vague, but because that's I didn't the want to most spoil it. that's the most generic thing. No, okay, okay. Here. In in Nino Kuni, if you don't do a certain side quest, you can't unlock the jump button like that. Oh, like, yeah. that no, yeah. I, I, you said that now before. You said that. Before. Yeah. I think that's it. Like I get like hiding skills, maybe like. It it makes running easier, but I think jump is like yeah, a kind of an important. I <laughs> love that game, but I never beat it because of that nonsense. It's so long. Like, it's I, so fucking it's so, it's so, there's it's so, so many funny. Yeah, it's, it's so, so funny. Long. I was playing in Xenoblade, that's parang because you walk around a lot in an RPG, right? That's yeah. parang in my head, like you programmer who figured out, oh, let's let's let let them jump, even though it doesn't amount to anything. It just makes walking more fun. It's like, yeah. oh yeah, jumping in an RPG is so non-essential, but it, it lets you do something when you're walking between cities. That's, yeah, that's why they added it in Dragon Quest Eleven too. Like, it, it <laughs> barely does anything, but it's there, and you can jump, and it's cool. It's funny. He goes, huh. Anyway. One more thing about Tales of Aris, and I'll go ahead. Ask uh, River about his gaming-related uh, weekend. Yes. The yeah. the other protagonist of this the girl is the most irritating cold-hearted person i've ever like it's it's so, so amazing that you can hate a, a protagonist so much because it they do the contrast in the the hero with the ooh everything's power of friendship hero uh, and they do this one uh, cold-hearted calculating and they really do a good job of making her hateable because that's what they want to do it and that and make her look hateable, and I'm sure. That's interesting. I'm sure they're gonna make a, a story on why she's like this. But yeah. as, so far as I'm playing it, I hate her, dude. To the point that I don't use her, even though she's <laughs> so good. <laughs> she's wow, stinks, dude. I hate her in the story so much. Well, there. I'm trying. I I don't think it's ever happened to me where like a character is written in such a way that I don't use them, even if they're powerful. Maybe there, there's just one character. Um, this was dude, Morgana. Despair, I'll give you yeah. an example. Morgana. Oh, there Morgana you go. Stinks, dude. Morgana <laughs> from what? From Persona, Persona 5. Five. Okay, speaking of Persona 5, another mishap happened with my PS4 where my AVR overheated. So I was like, oh shoot, I'm gonna burn my house down. So I unplugged Wait, that's it. That's different from the hard the hard R. No, so here's what happened. I unplugged it, right? But I forgot my PS4 was still in rest mode, quote unquote. And when it's in rest mode, sometimes it's, it has a dumb update. So I cut like the progress in half when it was updating. I, that's my theory, at least. Uh-huh. And I looked up that Sony, I don't know what it is. Maybe their chips are made out of tissue paper or something. <laughs> but if you, as soon as anything happens where an update is interrupted, it can just destroy your hard drive, like corrupt the data. Oh, and yeah. Th- uh, that, that happened and I just lost everything. Um, Mine, mine shuts down if uh, it's updating and you play a game. You can't download while you're playing a game when you're using my PlayStation. I, yeah, it, sh- it shut just... down. It shut downs at random times. So. I, I'm I'm yeah. surprised no one talks about this because like Fucking... I don't know. It, it, it they always like oh PlayStation Four one of the highest selling consoles of all time, but no one is like saying that just the slightest like touch of of uh, just the slightest I wrong s- move. I it's, swear, it's I I I miss you when you were like. Like, Are you about ano, to say back in my day, right. blah, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, I mean, that was already stressful enough. But like, okay, you're talking about like a PS5 is going to melt for whatever yeah. dumb reason. That's so unfair. 
I am playing, you know I'm playing like a Switch na like ano, it's <laughs> it's got like every fucking stick I have sa controllers are drifting. It's like I'm, it's like I'm playing ano, cross-eyed fucking fucking things na parang like gumag- gumagalaw lang siya. It's like what is this the future? It's gotten shitty or somehow. I know it, it reminds you of that um yeah, you yeah. space balls. Uh, the movie yeah, space balls. <laughs> Where there's this line where they try to go to hyperspace but it won't work. And it's like, even in the future, nothing fucking works. (laughs) Anyway. Who shot that cannon? Me, sir. (laughs) Yeah, his cross eye. (laughs) Oh, and another, okay, random space balls moment. We're like, we gotta comb the desert and find the the survivors. (laughs) And they're using an actual comb. And then they're like, have you found any progress? And then there's a black stormtrooper with the black guy comb. It's like, man, we can find shit. That's, anyway, a good, that's a good impression. Yeah. Thank you. Oh yeah, that sucks. The, the, the technology yeah. sucks. So I lost so, all my progress in Persona Five. Seventy hours of progress. Oh, it's all down the drain. So I'm not gonna that play that it. game. <laughs> a game that I hate. Can you believe that? <laughs> and I now I have to play that. it. I can I kind of believe that. Persona Five uh, is. No, you know what though? I okay. Here's the painful part. I recently started picking it up again. I'm almost done with the. Uh, the Futaba dungeon. And that part was interesting because um, it's kind of, this is kind of a spoiler if anyone's was listening. I, I guess, I don't know. But like, because all of the dungeons so far have been like abusive assholes. But this is the one dungeon where you're actually saving someone from themselves because the dungeons are their yeah. minds, kind of like in Psychonauts. So Futaba, she is, um, she's I think she's suicidal. So like throughout the 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 dungeon, you're like figuring out how to, help her see the truth she didn't cause should, her mom's death and whatnot and i was enjoying myself i was like why is this uh, no good <laughs> and then suddenly my ps4 broke so is there like a no is there like a character sa persona they should make a persona na parang may character na parang boo she's suicidal <laughs> and you get inside the dungeon you start uncovering about oh that's so sad she got hello she got stabbed in the head or something it's about like boo is there like was there no character no complete asshole? I think, I think Ryu, Ryuji is the closest one. I guess. So like, oh, well. But yeah, that's mostly because he's a dumbass, not really because he's an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> like he yells at her and anyway. But yeah, um but luckily though, for, a, for my PS4, even though I've owned it for like a couple months now, because of the way I play games where I focus on one game at a time, I didn't really lose a lot. Like uh, like with Bloodborne, I didn't get that far. Sekiro, I barely got that far. So I don't feel I told that you. Hurt. You stopped yeah, playing I it. I told you. <laughs> it's too hard. It's no, too I'm gonna fucking hard. I'm going to get back to it. I'm going to finish Bloodborne It's too fucking hard, first. dude. It's too fucking hard. I'm going to finish Bloodborne first. I'll get back wait, to wait, Sekiro wait. when I have I don't time. know if you asked this. What what made you like drop Sekiro? Like, god damn, this game. Okay. This fucking it's game. so stupid, but there's this character, there's this enemy type that has a shield, and that's it. It has He has a shield, and I don't know how to kill him. I don't know how to get behind him. I can't jump on him. It's just, I don't know. Told you. And, and then they introduced two of that guy with the shield, and I was like, I'm, I'm out. I'm not going to do this anymore. <laughs> Fuck this. Yeah. Fuck you and your technology. I don't uh, want to play. I, I don't want to play. I know. I don't want to play any more. Your souls, likes. Uh, yeah, I'm I think burned I'm, out. I think I'm okay. Nasa two, yeah. to Dark Souls two. I had so much fun in Dark Souls two. I, I, like, I was thinking about this. Um, I was watching a review of um, <laughs> Far Cry. Far Cry Gustavo. Oh, Spring. the new one. Six. Yeah, yeah Six. the new one, right? Because they were Is saying. Uh, Is it out? It might be reviews yeah. now. It's probably it's, out. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, they said right. it's a, uh, it's just more Far Cry. Better. Really? It's like oh incremental. God, it's like just incre- Maganda naman yung acting and everything. But like I, I honestly think it looks like sobrang galing na actor ni Gustavo Frank. Pero they turned him into 3D shit. So it like looks horrible. Because uh, like you really? know how good of an actor he is. Yeah, so like yeah. when you see na parang, you know. That's a problem with video games. They don't know how to make eye contact with you, and they're looking at your character. Well, it's like, hello. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it the never only works. actor that that worked with was Kevin Spacey in Call of Duty, and that's mostly oh, because he 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 does look creepy even if you look him in the eye. For, for I was wa- I was wondering about this. Na parang, if it's just incremental progress from the last type of game that you played, and it's like even if it's like. 
it's got some um improvements right but you played the last game for like a hundred hours aren't you just it's like it's like you you go to enchanted kingdom tapos they kind of cleaned up the park a little bit better now but it's basically the same thing it's like i don't know it's it's insane how much time we spent on games. this is yeah this is yeah, why yeah, i wait. skip some numbers i didn't play five and i didn't play primal and i didn't play whatever yeah. the newest one was so i i, I, I don't mind i played all the big ones <laughs> But it's it's the same thing though. Eh? Oh like, no! Yung, really? really? Well, no. I mean, it's the same formula. Yung parang you got a villain. You're in ano? You're in uh not Guatemala. Um, like a Cuba type thing. It it looks fine. I'm not saying it's yeah, bad. I'm yeah, just surprised. Just gonna, na. Diba river, diba river. What <laughs> asshole would play a game with the, basically the same with thing, the same just, thing over and over? Yeah. 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 What fucking made dickhead. by the same team, same people, yeah. same vision. <laughs> yeah. Same, same composer. Story. Oh, yeah, I'm so excited composer. for the next, the next Dragon Quest. Oh. I'm but they won't post. It's a different, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be Fred Durst, dude. It's gonna be eight <laughs> different masters of Limp Biscuit songs. I, uh, Just I, one I, of I those days. I re- oh my god. Oh my god! Don't say it. <laughs> um, I'm, I, I remember when we started this podcast. You'd never played a JRPG, and I think I, that's the I only know. thing you played now. <laughs> It's you like you why? played so many series. That's why you're here, River, for the indie <laughs> shit. What the hell is wrong? Hey, I mean, I'm trying to think of what was the last game I played that isn't a JRPG. I guess Miles Morales, but then, then it's like... Oh, that's even an indie that game. has leveling up, that's an indie game. Huh? It's not a JRPG. It's It doesn't yeah, have no. incest. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Spider 69 ing Oh, and it's funny because he started the para oh, I'm gonna play some JRPGs because I never got into Final Fantasy. Yeah, and you have never gotten into Final Fantasy. Still. I'm just yeah, I'm waiting for that Final Fantasy IX remake. I I, I don't know. Like that's not gonna happen. Like, that's not gonna. They happen. said they announced it. They announced no, it. No, no, it announced. I thought that they, they, they cleared the leak. They cleared the leak, right? Oh, it's really? Not, I don't know. Yeah, it's like okay, just an then, Nvidia thing. Then if Final Fantasy IX goes on sale on my Switch, I'm like, I'm gonna give it a shot because I but, I did play it for a bit when i was young i played it on a ps1 emulator and my laptop this got monkey stepped person on. oh <laughs> my, and my laptop got stepped on and never finished it so i didn't even get that, that far but that game is rough you nine in the way that the random encounters like the long yapak mo pa lang. this may random I mean, battle hey, oh i played dragon quest one and two it's kind of the same oh <laughs> I'm playing, I'm, I'm playing playing three right now and I'm having a lot of fun. I don't know I'm, why. I'm playing, you know, I'm playing like uh, Pokemon Unite with a friend. That was like River comes on. Oh, he's playing the Dragon Quest three. Oh, you see the notification. River Cruise is playing Dragon okay. Quest three. I wonder oh, if he's oh, surprised. An, I forgot. Okay, here's another thing. I forgot to say. I'm playing Diablo uh, Resurrected. Diablo two Resurrected. No, how is it? Oh, that one is fantastic. Game. It's really good. I, is it, this is a remaster of the PS one one. Yeah, I, I yeah. played the original one on PC the with the Lord the Lord of Terror DLC or whatever. It's not DLC, it was expansion pack back in it the day. It was an expansion pack. It's so good. It it feels just like how I remembered it. Um I think the sign of a good remaster is when you look at the graphics, when you look at how it feels, it's how you thought it felt back in the day. But then when you make it go back to the old graphics, you're like, Oh wow, this looks like dog shit. Good thing. <laughs> It's a good thing I'm short. Oh, because it can do Dragon Quest thing that I'm switching between graphics. You can modes. switch, yeah. You That's can so you know, cool. press a button. I switch back and forth. Oh, my God, those pixels are huge. Like back in the day, I can I mean, you know, I'm playing on a bigger TV too, so it's like even more obvious how how rough it used to be. It came out like 2000. I never yeah. got to play that, but I remember your friends go saving your kind of characters on diskettes. And go yes, to the computer yeah. shop to play. Just run out. You can but, continue your save somewhere else. Yeah, so uh, that's it's so fun. Sad. I'm, I'm playing. I'm playing the. I'm playing two classes. The one, the class that I grew up in, is a paladin, and then another. I'm playing the druid. Like both of those classes, yeah. very different. But I'm having a ton of fun. Yeah. Yeah. Fun yeah. Um, I recommend it more, if anyone wants to play that. And use pala like I read lang ma uh, lecture set me something. They're making a twisted metal series or a yes movie? yeah TV i heard of that too yeah TV and show, you know yeah. who's playing sweet tooth the the insane clown oh, with I, remember, the I, wait, I remember this kevin spacey it's not kevin no, spacey. no 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 <laughs> it's not as... who is it who is he's it? gonna he's gonna be uh okay. chris pratt is it chris pratt <laughs> no 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 it's the guy who played hawk Dunsa, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kevin the black Mackie. guy oh. yeah kevin Mackie. uh yeah. Oh. 
Anthony Mackie. Anthony Mackie. I like him. Man, he's really sweet. Anthony Mackie yeah. is sweet tooth. Okay. Yeah, that's a an interesting choice. God damn. That's such so he's gonna play both parts. Can <laughs> okay. he play an oak? Can he play is like a serial killer? Maybe this is a flex. So. You know, uh, you know who? Well, I, I'm, I'm welcome to Anthony Mackie because I think he has the body, man, for it. But like, I thought of who would play a perfect sweet tooth. It's si Vincent who? D'Onofrio. Um, oh, Kingpin. He already yeah. looks like a serial killer. You don't even have to put yeah. him in the like a... And and Twisted Metal Black Sweet Tooth was fat. Yeah, it was, it was, like, oh, it was so thick. fucking scary. Yeah. You know, no FMVs. I think Twisted Metal has the o- is the only game to do FMVs right. Like I, I swear, yeah. Team Black was so scary looking. Yeah, yeah. and he's gonna play both, pala, both Sweet Tooth and Roadkill. Because Roadkill and Sweet Tooth, some Twisted Metal lore is one person. So yeah. Oh. No. Wait, is Roadkill black? No, <laughs> either is Sweet Tooth. So. Wait, who's who I don't think it matters oh. though. Yeah. Roadkill is Ro- chain, chain Super Mario in the games na yon, where all of his stats are normal. Yeah. Is it yung ba yung ano yung parang motor? No, si Grim, uh, si Mr. Grim yon. Si Roadkill yung may orange na car. Orange okay. sports car. Oh, okay. Especially yeah, in pictures. Boomerang. Okay, sige. Well, I think, I think, how, how do you think, do you think it's gonna be cool? I, w- I want it to be like True Detective scary. If you can do it like that. Yeah. I, I like that it's a show. It's great. So what I are you gonna say, Robert? Yet, but... Oh, I was just gonna, gonna say, say I like that it's a show because I feel like, you know, with, with the way that you describe the lore of Twisted Metal, it, it seems so deep, and I feel like if they made it like an hour, yeah. or two hour long movie, it'll cheapen it. Mm-hmm. So I'm good that they're giving it, you know, space to breathe. That's why um, me and Giselle talked about this. Where, 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 where are you at with uh, live out a- live action adaptations of anime? Oh, is this Cowboy Bebop? Yeah, um, I don't know. I, I I get the point. Like because it's like, oh cool, I get to see my two D people in real life. Now I feel less alone. But I <laughs> here was my point, River. Like <laughs> yeah. that's why it worked. Cause it was a fucking anime. If you put yeah. any of their costumes to regular people, they're gonna look dumb like cosplayers. I mean, we can all agree cosplayers stink, right? No, I'm kidding. I, <laughs> I like cosplayers. Do you get yeah. what I'm saying, River? Like, you budget yeah, you. of those explosions in outer space. I'm trying I to think. Like... I yeah. just think it looks lame because it's copied. It's like they're copying it. It's too copied. It's like too yeah. tried hard. They, this is the thing. I don't know how... Uh, I'm not, Like, how the Western, like, Hollywood was able to capture comic books better as live action but i think it's because they don't try to be accurate anymore they gave up on that they were like fuck it we're gonna make a loosely interpreted version they don't use they the same you, exact they get you costume. a core of what's cool yeah, about exactly each concept. Yeah, yeah. yeah i think your problem with like the cowboy bebop one is um it's just you, it doesn't capture your feeling of when you watch your first Cowboy Bebop, which is because, oh, this is visionary. This is, no one's ever done yeah. this before. And now it's like, we're going to copy Tank. Blah, blah, blah. And I just don't like it. <laughs> it just makes me feel bad. But like, I'm, I'm open to it. You know, you, you know they shouldn't, I feel like they shouldn't have done Cowboy Bebop first. I think Samurai Champloo would have been better. As, I, that's, what as I was, I, that's what I say yeah. on Did Twitter. Did you say that? The one person. Like I said, yeah. the cha- Samurai Champloo actually has a story Cowboy Bebop is like it's like Pulp Fiction. It's like yeah. just a lot it's of just loose non-sequiturs. Stuff. And yeah. I think the budget, because the samurai champ, look, say there's no explosions. Yes. There's... Oh, cool samurai fights. Like again, the biggest, um, the best though was Rooney Kenshin in live action, which oh, yeah, yeah. I didn't. I, think, I, I hated just like it. just like five of those it. now. Yeah. <laughs> I've never Thank seen you. a single one. Oh, it's I just. Actually... Because it's such a low bar, na Giselle, yeah. of live action anime. It's, know, it's already people samurai. Love, You've seen yeah. that, yeah. You know, people love how it looks, but then you got scenes na parang they're adapting from like, like first of all, it doesn't make any sense to people who didn't watch the movie because they're just random shit strung together. Because yeah. they put in yung Ruruni Kenshin Ova with yung death ng asawa ni Tamoe, yes. yeah, and yeah. it doesn't make any sense because they, <laughs> they don't explain it. That was <laughs> it. Do just yung... kind of happens. <laughs> and they just, they just do this overwrought because ver- that boop river you should watch him over no Ruruni Kenshin. It's a standalone thing. It's, it's actually great. it's beautiful. Awesome. It's like on the level of um ghost 
Ghost in the Shell. Ganun siya. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I gotta check it out. And like, there's this part na parang he's killing this dude. Tapos the dude keeps getting up. And like, it's a scene na parang, dude, you already saw everyone get slaughtered. Just fucking stay down. He was already walking away. Pero you're just like, I have to be alive. And then he comes back and kills him. And it's just, it just takes you out of it because it's like, it's so overwrought and dumb. And like, it doesn't make sense. And then, pero everyone looks accurate. The guy who plays si Sanusuke is perfect. If, if, if that's anything, I enjoyed that. Naman. But it's just, pero it's you, you know what made me laugh? Yung kay, uh, Jusel, yung kay Saito Hajime, yung bigla siyang sumingit. So, oh, fuck, that, fuck that guy. Nakakainis. <laughs> without, so without, without any background about who he is. It's just, there, there are people who will show up and the only thing carrying them is yung uh, pagiging cool. nilang uh, cool. Yeah. No, no. It's yeah. just the idea uh, na, oh, I like this character. I remember yeah. yung background niya sa story. Pero this is not the This is a movie. It's just, yeah. it's like Wolverine. It's like when people when Wolverine shows up in any X Men movie, he doesn't really do anything. But it's like, oh, that's Wolverine. He's supposed to be cool. So like, you don't He's have supposed to, do to be so there. It's an X Men movie. Nga, this kind of reminds me of the Dragon Quest V movie, where you would not understand what was going on if you haven't played the games prior, because it's obvious that they didn't make it for people who haven't played the games. Yeah. I think that's the same thing with the Kenshin movies. Yeah. Samurai X movies. I, I think I say I think those stories are good. Eh. It's just you know like you do the extra work to make to actually like adapt. To make it make it. sense, like standalone. Yeah, it's, it's not as if it's like a video you game. You know doesn't have a They should story. have made it a series, na lang. That would yeah, have exactly. That, that should have made a limited series. Yeah, I, that's why I'm glad that I don't know, to make it, make it go back. Like I feel like I'm to some metal has a chance if it's gonna be a series. Because honestly, now I, I watch more like long form limited series than actual movies lately. Like I'm. I started watching Midnight Mass, the new Ooh. Um, yeah. horror type thing from that guy who made uh, Doctor Sleep and Haunting of Hill House. Oh, he made Doctor and Sleep. I like yeah, Sleep. Uh, Mike Flanagan, Doctor Sleep, Haunting of Hill House, uh, Bly Manor. Or in Japanese, Mike Flanagan. Mike Flanagan, Mike Flanagan. But Mike yeah, <laughs> what's that about? <laughs> Midnight Mass. It's basically about this guy who killed uh, a teenager in a car accident because he was drunk. So he's trying to find redemption, or not necessarily the redemption. He's like trying to start over by going back to his hometown, which is a small ocean island. And then they have like it's so tightly knit. There's like just a hundred people long, and then they have one church that they always go to. Then one day the regular priest, this really old priest, didn't show up, and it was this new young hip priest. And ever since he yeah, <laughs> and ever priest. since he showed up, the TikTok <laughs> priest. Hashtag praise it. And yeah, he's, he, he knows all the cool hashtags the kids use. So yeah. All right, so, so like so they get this dope. new young priest, and then ever since then there's like these weird shit going on. And it's it's pretty good so far. I'm only on episode two, but um it's really promising. Oh, okay. oh yeah, okay. I heard in Twitter and it's very dialogue heavy though. I don't mind. Yeah. That, that's kind of the show. Mm-hmm. But yeah. That's that's funny. Okay, so it's all about Smash. Oh yeah, about... yeah I yes. saw this one. See Sora. Um, did you guys watch it? Yeah, <laughs> I yeah I saw the. I the don't know why people hand. are surprised. No, what I'm not Disney characters. Then uh, some people are surprised. Yeah, yeah. fuck, it's Disney, dude. As much as I love Disney, ooh, family friendly, dude. They're take, they're fucking corporate. There's you know, basically. You know, yeah, yeah. Yun, yun tweet ko is like, I know, the, the Smash reveal is that this is actually Kingdom Hearts 4. <laughs> <laughs> if you think about it, it's like, oh, this is a new Kingdom Hearts game because si Sora showed up. She lang yung last character. Sora. He, 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 instead of invading the world of Disney, he invaded the world of video games. Of Mario. You well, know, actually, that's the thing, yeah. Which is like, kind of weird because you see, he was in a video game. <laughs> I know. Is that funny? I, I don't know. It's because I remember Sora was the number one most asked for at the time in like the Wii U era, Smash 4, the fourth one, where they made an actual poll, like Nintendo sent out a poll. Who do you want us to make as a DLC character? Because they started bringing in like random DLC characters. They brought in Cloud. That was a big deal. They brought in Snake. Bayonetta, like stuff like that. Snake. Mm-hmm. So they're like, oh, okay, the doors are open to non-Nintendo characters. So everyone voted Sora at the time, and I think everyone just forgot that because now he's there and everyone's complaining. 
I think it's because he's an anime sword character, like a lot of the Fire Emblem characters. <laughs> so, where think... Joker was a stabby stabby anime character. Yeah, Joker's a shooty you know, shooty no, no. stabby stabby. Are you disappointed that it's Joker to smash instead of like someone you like? And I, think I he's mean, a, he's, he's the best man. He, I he's get the it. most popular, yeah. the most uh-huh. iconic looking. But you know yeah, how I many? It's true. I, I don't. I don't care. I just read one. He appears in most of the gay yaoi fan fictions. On like I say, also the, of Joker. Yeah, dude. I, I got into a that in the Persona Four. I got into a wild thing where I read fan Persona Four fan fiction. That's okay. Uh-huh. So, yeah, there's a lot of dude. There are a lot of yaoi versions. Oh, I'm of those sure. Characters. Like I was. I watched this like YouTube channel, cartoonist gay fave. That was he went to Japan. That's there's a whole. Shelf of um, Teenage Boy Mutant Love? Ninja Turtles, okay. Yaoi. Incest. Oh, really? <laughs> I'm sorry to be oh. it's, it's like no Jinchi and Dame. And then he said, that, Oh, I'm gonna send this to the creators and Ninja Turtles guys because it's kind of That's so funny. Just How did they react? Oh, Eastman. Well, yeah, it's just very interesting because they have lax um, copyright laws there. Like, if they, oh. they know oh. that they're not affected with like small print runs of like a thousand a month. So it's like, pero the thing then with like comic at there, it's like, um, you're not buying from them. You're giving them money. It's a different, mm, to uh, make term- more, to make more of what they like. There's different terminology. It's not necessarily it's like, like, yeah, it's like face to face Patreon, basically. Or sorry, something like that. Yeah. There's like, there's very, there's very strict about laws, but like that specifically they're fine with that. It's a different, different foot clan. If you know what I mean? I cried. I cried dun sa ano, sa, kasi I'm an idiot. Or I cried dun sa, sa Smash reveal. Not because it's mm-hmm. sore, kasi I knew it was sore. I like, I was like getting choked up kasi si Sakurai is like, eh, hey, what's yeah. up? Like he was doing his, 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 ano, his loose 10 minute set na parang just making fun of him. Like, he's fucking he's, joking he's around. About his, he was doing his tight five, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, like, he's gonna get like, a feature what? spot soon, eh, so. He's, he's doing some crowd work. He was talking to the cameraman behind. Mario, don't eat ass. I was like, oh, I didn't know. He was making fun. Oh, that's cool. I'm, I'm glad that he's finally going to sleep for eight hours. Mm. It's been a while for him, I bet. He looks like that porn star in the midget. <laughs> you know what I'm, I'm saying? Sorry. You know what I'm saying about? There's that... Porn star, Japanese porn star, in that, who's like, oh, he has like shorter bones, like as he's he's a uh, he's a disfigurement, but he looks like a little kid. Si Sakura just looks like the the tall version of the that. older version. Yeah, para si Hugh Laurie kind of looks like Peter Dinklage, for the tall yeah, version. Yeah, no, I get Peter that. Dinklage. I get that. Yeah, they're at the top of their fields, respectively. You know, porn <laughs> for both of them. Yeah, exactly. Sakura. How do you feel about how do you feel about the skins? They they released like costumes. The Doom guy was there. I love Doom oh. guy. Doom guy looks yeah. beautiful. He looks great. I lo- yeah, well, I think well, well, that's well, well, what is the Doom guy's new skin? No, no, he's like- just there because you have me fighters there. The para okay. create a character. Tapos there yeah. are three types: sword, punching, and then uh, guns. Gun. Yeah. So that's how they put in a lot of other people. So like, see yeah. Doom guy, he looks perfect. Like I, great. I think, yeah. I honestly, f- I know like you know they're just costumes, but it it's so a lot of them are so good. Freaking Cuphead is there, Sans yeah. from Undertale is there. I don't know. They, they they go crazier with the costumes and the actual characters, and I get why. It's 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 harder to get the rights for an actual character. I like. But I think it's I like huge young, that Sora is there. I don't like that. No, no. I don't like that it was wasted to Octoling, but I understand that they have to promote. I mean, they already had an inkling. Yeah, mm. It's like a bit, I don't know. But people say I the mean, same thing. Like, you already have Ike, so why do you have Morith? You already have Morith, so why do you have Robin? And so on and so forth. Every Fire Emblem character. Yeah, it seems like maybe they drew straws or something. But like you get six characters for Fire Emblem in this game or something. Um... So I am not gonna buy Zisora. I'm happy for everyone, but I'm not, I don't care. Uh, I have stopped playing Smash because I'm not. Are you Damn. good at Smash? I'm okay at Smash. I, I don't know. I haven't bought any of the new character packs, even though I want to buy the pack, character pack one because it has the Dragon Quest characters. I haven't. I haven't tried it, but yeah, I, 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 I don't know. Smash for me Dragon is a lot Quest. like Animal Crossing, 
Or like I uh, loved the game when it first came out. I played it a lot, like religiously, but then I just dropped it and I, I never really went back. I might go back and try to play because like, but it's just so uh, umpangat ng net ko, you know. I just want to play well. Yeah. Do you guys, um, uh, you guys ever play Kingdom Hearts? I never played Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Okay. So I am. I played the Kingdom Hearts one sa PS2 until naghang yung CD when the cloud came, and I was very early on in the game. <laughs> and I kind of want to try. But I might download in demo to see. Like I wanna, I'm interested in cloud gaming. It's such a weird thing because it's not it's, a physical engine. It's not yeah. like you're not you're not gonna download it. It's like streamed. That's oh. that. I tried that. It's PS3 oh. without it. It yeah. sucks because our <laughs> internet here is balls. So you, I tried playing uh, the first. Uh, I like I tried playing the games up. Uh, Yung twisted metal games of PS3, oh, yeah. it's balls, dude. It doesn't work. Uh, that would. I, suck. I, I know. If it was, I, I get it for an RPG. I, I wouldn't get it for like a. Yeah, like I made the mistake of playing God of War Ascension uh, through cloud. Uh, I did the same thing Andrew did. Like I, on my PS4 through the PlayStation. Uh, I forgot what it was called PS Now. Uh, you can, you for some reason they can't. They don't have the hardware for the PS3 games. PS2 games you can download fine, but if it's a PS3 game, you have to stream it through cloud. I was playing a, a freaking high octane oh, action yes. game. No, because it it, sometimes it's games. good, sometimes it's ass. Yeah, it's so very. PS3 games are the most yeah. complicated games to program, though. So porting them are near impossible. So it's yeah. like kaya daw yun yung gina for the Kingdom Hearts, because like some of those are PS3 games, and they they're just not gonna bother with like. So why did they just port just... the Xbox 360 version? Or I, I mean, know. like the the PC version. I don't know. I don't know. Who is... eh. but I I would want to play it, eh. because you know um. Actually, maybe I don't want to play, but, but I just want to look cool. Maybe that's what I want. I just I'd, want I'd the, the feeling play to say na para ano. For me, Kingdom Hearts is almost at that barometer of like, am I gonna am I gonna make this my new Dragon Quest? Because like, <laughs> am I gonna play every game in every or in this in the order? I don't know. Because for me, uh, the games that are close to that level, I might play all the Tales games if I can. I might give the Final Fantasy Good game boy. a shot. Okay. Yeah, because I played Vesperia. And I'm gonna play Final Fantasy. I honestly think I it's, that that's not it's not worth it. if it's not nine. I don't think yeah. it's it's that it's worth not, it. If it's not fourteen or you remake, it's kind of hard to go back to. I see, I remember this one E3. I don't know if it was two thousand thirteen or fourteen, where they they, they show Cloud Sword, <laughs> and like people were cheering, "Woo! At the next Final Fantasy reboot, pare!" And it was just a port of the old game, and you could hear <laughs> the cheers die down, like, uh, "Yay!" <laughs> <laughs> No, that made me laugh. People Part, aren't uh, even happy about your remake. I mean, they're not. No, it was it was well received. It's no, no, but it, it's yeah. not like it's not like Animal Crossing. The people went insane. It's like the I think you know, Square Sock was expecting it would sell better oh, yeah. than it did. Oh yeah, it's, yeah it right, didn't yeah. like like people like it, but people aren't like. I love this as much as your old game. I don't yeah, know. I feel like people ter- got a bit turned off now. Hanggang sa Midgard lang yung chapter. Well, it's still it's a, a different long game. game. It's still longer yeah. than the first game. Yeah. So it's like... I think it's pretty ballsy. In, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm excusing laziness here, but I think it's pretty cool that they they decided to flesh out one area instead of do the whole game in one disc. I don't know. Yeah. How many discs does, uh, does it have? I never... Um, if I remember, uh, three, three discs. Three, really? yung, three discs. Yung, ano, um, three discs. Yung FF7, four discs. Yung FF8, FF eight, and then FF9. nine four discs. Then. Four discs. Jeez. What was I the think... last game you played that had multiple discs? Maybe God of War. It's so Xbox 360 or something. Wait, what did you say, Adam? I think yun na, yung Final Fantasy IX. Kasi, uh, yun na yung time na. Kasi when Final Fantasy IX came out, doon na lumabas yung PS2. And I don't remember fair, PS2 yeah. having two discs. The last two. game I played that had multiple discs was L.A. Noir. That one had two discs, and I don't know why. 
<laughs> I think they uh, there's so much space. They, they I think they, the, the the facial animations took up too much space to go to. I don't know. Yeah, I think I think I know. Um, it's all about depression. It's yeah. all about depression. Got Here it. we go. Um, okay, okay. Um, um, I've been depressed. Okay. As you might know, if this is my gender reveal party. I'm depressed. Um, have I used any example? Have I used video games to get through depression? Um, you know what? I think early in the pandemic, I used the no. I used Animal Crossing to get through a lot of stuff. Mm. But no, I think a lot of people use the no. Okay, it called Banjan. Early on in the pandemic, did you have like a game that parang you were playing? Like a comfort um, game. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. It's both. Like I say, I don't know comfort gaming Neo too. It it's be. so hard. Like, um, what made me stop playing Neo two was when I couldn't run out of the because I was so frustrated. Like I threw the controller <laughs> in a soft place. Huh? It's a bed go. I okay, slammed yeah. it really hard. It's a bed go, and I started talking to my PS four like it was an actual person. Fucking do it. And I, I just calm down. Isn't it like, funny? Na it's like it's a move in anger, pero iba pa to do pero sa malambot na lugar. Oh, yeah. 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 So I stopped. I did. I. It, I guess it depends on the game. If you, you're gonna play a game of pandemic, let it not be a hard one. Oh, so, yeah. it's but, it was Dark Souls. Know. That was amazing. That yeah. You know, the okay. you know. I, I was gonna say Dark. I guess for me, I mean, I don't. I don't know if uh, I, I don't have a history of depression, but I have been like numb and down, and I feel like that's just like the effect of the, the being cooped up in the pandemic. Mm. I don't know. Like I, I get na. I kind of bounce between like, do I play a fun, breezy game to feel good about myself, or do, do I play I a really, myself? or do I play Shin Megami Tensei where I, <laughs> where I Question because I beat morale. it, I yeah, where yeah. I, like it's also really like tough as nails, and but because I beat it, I'm like, if I can beat this, I guess I can do great things. I don't know. I press the button really well. <laughs> no, I, I I mean I'm I'm selling myself short, but like clearly like, you know, a lot of games, you know, there's a reason why certain games can help people pull through certain things because you know games a lot of games take skill you know they take they take effort so if you do something that takes effort then you get i don't know you get a nice congratulations or a thank you i love when games do that where like the it's mostly indie games where there's a developer and they say like thank you for playing our game or mario mario does that games don't really isn't, do that isn't anymore that, isn't that so amazing i remember i wish games were like that Yung parang, it was like, thank you for playing our game that's so nice Alam mo yun, instead of like ano, parang something shitty like Dark Souls na parang it you just died. died. It's a literal <laughs> screen died. that said you died. I know I died, you <laughs> I know I fucked oh, died Dark Souls. <laughs> and here, uh, to continue lang na, you saw games. I, I got fucking hard into Stardew Valley and Terraria. Ah, uh, yeah. Like creating my own world free of this disease. Buti na lang, walang corona option. Oh, well, then, you that. might really like it, the Dragon Quest Builders. Builder, yeah, I bought it. Di ko pa nila lalo. Kasi nila lalo ko pa yung Tales of Arise. Arise, Arise, yeah, Tales of Arise. Is it Arise? Is it Arise? Arise, it's Arise. It's still there. I haven't played it. It's pretty cool. So That's pretty I'm gonna cool. get back to it. Well, like I know, like I know, um, Spirit Fairer. I, I oh think that was a lot of a very helpful know. game, yeah. Oh my god. I was thinking Was it though? Because it was so fucking sad. I know, but it helped <laughs> me be sad about something else for once. It's <laughs> Yo, <laughs> River, the best, uh, the best the best you bull. You bull oh my god. The, the bull and the have you guys the played in DLC? I haven't out? yet. I don't want to cry. I'm not ready. That's <laughs> such a, such a, such a, that's such a fucking weird thing. We're gonna provide you DLC with this fucking depressing game. <laughs> Let's find out like, how this one will wreck your soul. Yeah. <laughs> That's like watching fucking your name again. Like, I don't yeah, want to yeah. watch this again. I like your name. I, like I love it. Yeah. That is so different. You Wait. get what I'm saying? Like, a silent. I'm going to watch a silent voice oh again. Oh my God. I'm going to watch. I want to watch it again. I, I like so watching good. it. I know. I like watching movies with people. 
Because I like showing I, them that I cry. <laughs> you know my partner did to me the other night? Uh, Leanne showed me Grave of the Fireflies. Yeah, and that was yeah, the one Ghibli movie. That's the one Ghibli movie I was avoiding because I know it was oh, going to destroy you me. You never watched Grip of the Fire. I, I avoided that, it because I, I knew I know that the. It's I mean, so this good. Is, I know so that sad. the sister dies, but I thought I that was a, a big reveal. But it's not. But, but, In the beginning of the movie, they show that she dies. I have a yeah, friend yeah. that para who laughed at the said stone, kumakansa na stones or something, and then she's like, "Haha, kumakansa ng putek or something like that." <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with you. You know the Love best it. meme. That's, that that that's a coping mechanism. What you're doing? Yeah. Alala. The best meme I've seen about getting for the. Na ako to kasi. Hey, name three hungry characters. Pinakat si Naruto, si guys sa One Piece, <laughs> si Goku, the si sister. <laughs> oh my god. That's so funny. It was that's so, so sad. Funny. Did you like it? Movie. I loved it though. It's a great film. I can't deny it that it's a. One well, the thing that I love about that movie is it paints America as the assholes. I get that, like you know, pe- both sides did awful things, so it's cool to see the other side of that. Yeah, the wind rises, Yeah, I exactly. Was, I honestly wonder if he would like anime and video games if they didn't get atom bombed. I know that's such a <laughs> shitty thing to say, but like, really. I mean, diba? It's like I think there's I something about I wouldn't have Godzilla. But uh, yeah, you fucking enslaved us and killed all, all of our babies. But like, come on, you guys melted. So but I guess it's e- it kind of even. I guess out. we're even. Yeah, Stevens, matam, yeah. Mata sa mata ng ipin sa ipin. Yeah. Did you did you feel the same way about 9/11, Giselle? Did you feel the same way about? I don't want to talk. I was a sh- it was I was a shitty fucking high school kid. But like, oh, they should make a 9/11 game, but it's a platformer. <laughs> 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 Oh my Get god. <laughs> and then every oh, time you respawn as a different character <laughs> out the window. How would you, you do that? Dead like, you know, how would you do that like as a video game? Is there game a game, in is there a game set in 911 like an official not like a shitty like fan made you no. know those like shitty no, flash uh, no games. video game designer is going to fucking oh, you know make I a think game on 911. I think I, I think Animal Crossing canonically happens during 911. Why? Animal Crossing New Leaf. Well, I know. <laughs> is it because they have strict airline um, you're checking before you go in? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can't bring a bottle over nine ounces or something. Yeah. <laughs> you have to remove can... your shoes, put it on a tray. Isn't it crazy that your lasting effect of 9 11? I can't bring on shampoo sa, sa yeah. Yeah. So mental illness. What a happy <laughs> joke. Mental Pero, illness. Oh, mm. um, to get a bit back on track, then you. What really helped me is uh, mental illness was writing jokes. Na hindi tungkol sa pandemic, kasi it, it kind of tricked my brain into thinking, oh, there are other shit happening, naman. Again, super important yung mara- nangyari sa pandemic, na maraming yeah. shit na nangyari. Pero like, selfishly speaking, oh fuck, I can think of something, make fun of something that, that doesn't have to do with this fucking shitty bat virus. So, <laughs> uh, how about you? you know, how, how did you cope down gaming related? River or just mm. I mean not gaming related. I I started a podcast. That that's one. Um yeah. <laughs> I'm on this freaking podcast with you guys. That's one yeah. other thing. Another one. Um thing. I guess another thing is uh I I this is loosely gaming related, but it's more on like exercise. Like I got Ring Fit Adventure. I was like the only way no. I'm gonna exercise if if I can grind if I can grind and level up. So I got Ring Fit Adventure, which is exercise, but it's a JRPG. You and if it's dude. See, River um, probably would have been like ripped now if you could use Ring Fit's uh, and the Dragon Quest. The thing about Ring Fit, though, it's it's it is a real workout. So I so I'm supposed to be doing it like three times a week. I only do it like once a week. Like, I stopped. Uh, I stopped doing it now. Like I'm I'm fine with my workout. That's that's yeah. good. Good for you. But like it, I just it was too weak for just yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Because it's Dude. cardio. It's cardio. I'm trying to build muscle, so para mm. it does it doesn't help. Pero like. You're not. Uh, what chapter are you on? It's so long. It's a long game. It's a fucking I, long game, dude. It's, I can't they really believe. stretch it out. But I, 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 I don't even pay attention to the story anymore. You got like these four guardians that focus on each muscle. Like this what? one is the calf you're not, guardian. You're not. No, wait. By your ab guardian. <laughs> the ab guardian. You're not, no, you're not, wait, wait, wait. There's a character named the ab guardian. No, no. Yeah, there's this, a character named Abdonis. Abdonis. Then, dude, this game like, rules. Le- leg, and even the leg. 
I got Legulus. I forgot. <laughs> I don't know. This is Allegra. Like, this Allegra. About, Allegra. Is Allegra. I forgot what's the R, the bicep one called. I forgot. But they they got all these like crazy names. It is fun. I, I I yeah. That's one thing like exercising because a lot of people forget. Uh, I, I love people love to joke like, oh, we're just brains. We're just brains floating in a, a liquid bone <laughs> bone tank. People say that they always say like, uh, like haha, I'm just my brain. I'm just a consciousness. This body is nothing. But like, people forget <laughs> that what happens to your body affects your mind, yeah, affects your yeah. brain. If if you're like uh, irritable over the smallest thing, you probably didn't drink enough water, and like your brain is just reacting in a way that you know that it should react. That's very true. That, so I'm trying to like be more conscious of my body. I'm trying not to just be a piece of shit on the couch. <laughs> type person it's easy to fall into that trap and i'm not it's saying like if, if you are dude. i'm not saying like if you all you do is play video games you're a piece of shit i'm, I'm calling myself that i'm just saying like i, I don't know i just i don't want yeah, you're right. to you're, you're, yeah. you're right river just say it. I, I talked about this with Giselle. i don't know if you heard it like i fell into this trap now i was treating my body like shit like the yeah. order on them um sausage and cheese Stuff oh. crust, crust pizza on a family size, oh, and I was eating it with my boxer shorts shirtless. How about none of old old episodes of Rocco's Modern Life? And I'm like, oh, that sounds great. Love. You're cosplaying a heifer. That sounds like heaven, though. <laughs> you <laughs> cosplaying a heifer. I, I love, I, I love in joke. I love in jokes. I know. So they see si heifer goes sa bahay ni Rocco. So but oh, Rocco's not here. I guess I have to eat his food before it spoils. In food's a ref. Just goes as a fucking yeah. breath, just eats everything. What the fuck? Um, you, you know what's the sweetest, here. the sweetest episode in Rahul's modern life? When he was gay, so ever, they had like children. Yeah, when they fucking 69 don't see CR. No. <laughs> so, uh, no, they did see you see a film. Right? Yeah, yung yung part na yung sinabi nilang adopted si Heifer. Kasi his family is oh, a family of that. wolves. Well, and like yeah. kakainin nila sana si Heifer, pero nakiyutan sila sa kanya. So they yeah. raised him as his own. That was that was a great episode. That is a great episode. Um, Kasi, natawa may beat doon yun <laughs> Okay, guys. I'm gonna have to admit, sabi ng tatay ni Heifer, there's an adopted one in this family. Tapos sabi ni Heifer, Woo! You! Kasi may kapatid din si Heifer. I'm sorry! You're adopted. <laughs> <laughs> that's so dumb. Uh, yeah, that's um, yeah, bro, did you like the movie? There was a movie kind of recently. It was great. Movie. It was I great. Liked, yeah. uh, it didn't overstay its welcome. Hmm. It was quote unquote woke, but it didn't shove it in your face. Yeah, yeah it yeah. really was about him finding himself. I love it. It made yeah, sense for the character in a, such a strange way because they didn't overboard it. Tapos, hmm. I like the. <laughs> I like that it made you want more episodes because you saw na para, oh they could actually do it. They can yes. well, they're well, not gonna, it, yeah. they don't that's give how a I shit. felt about no, no, after Invader Zim too, the the Florpus movie. I felt the same way. I was like, are they bringing back Invader Zim? Because like no, they, they nailed it, but they. Didn't I didn't like all. Invader Zim. Like I couldn't. Yeah, I, like it. Reboot, I liked it. You I thought movie. it was great. They actually made him evil at that <laughs> yeah. at that movie. I, yeah. gonna, I wanna watch, pero like I. I think I'm done with John and Vasquez humor now. Like, but that's um, fair. But uh, oh, like I, I'm not, I'm not in. I, I don't know. I, I don't feel like must na get na na. I feel like Rajo grew up even more so. It was pretty. Yeah. It was pretty old. That like it I got. I don't know it how. Naman. Pero they, sa, they made sa, it modern. Yeah. I love. I love you. Main plot the in Rajo rebooting something. It's not gonna. Solve all of your problems. Yes, which exactly. one, yeah, I love it. It's so good. It was so smart. It's uh, so good. It was so but good. Zim, kasi, I think it's a Zim. Um, hello, hello. I think it's a Zim because <laughs> it didn't end well. It had a lot of loose threads. So like that's that's why I thought they were gonna continue it. I thought they were doing that on purpose so they could continue, but it just doesn't. It's not. Uh, no, it's like because it's a Rocco. It's just uh, it's just a reunion episode because it really ended, naman. Like, I, I felt like it had a real termination. But in this uh, sa Zim, there were so much things that they couldn't explore. So I think in your problem with like things na parang we're gonna try to put all of the things that you want that we wanted to do into one thing, but like we couldn't do. So para it's like the Firefly movie, the I mean, Firefly it's not movie. bad. It's like a zombie na yung kapatid niya. No, oh, no. Fuck. <laughs> Serenity, Serenity, <laughs> the Joss Whedon. Oh, Firefly movie. Okay. <laughs> 
And uh, I don't, I think I know why Riverdale hindi nila kinontinue yung Invader Zim. Kasi the guy who voiced Invader Zim oh, is, he's the, he's, pero he's no, doing, no, no, see, Jonathan Vasquez is the first, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Um, He's doing a new project. It's called he Hell was, of a Boss. You, oh, I, was gonna get I know that one. By, yeah, that I, was on YouTube. Dude, yeah, and I, as I was watching it, ang main, ang main in his, I would have enjoyed this when I was 16. Oh, I so get what you too, mean. It's too. But it, I don't. I don't what I don't, what I don't project know. is this? What? What? Hell of a boss. The, of a boss. the, 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 the self-produced animated YouTube yeah. like movie or yeah. series or whatever. The, the animation's great, but again, yeah. subjective. Like, oh wait, is this the girl who works in like uh, Pepsi Pop? Hell and Hell? Yeah, Vivzi pa- yeah. has been hotel. That's the other one. Yeah. Has been. Oh, hotel. that's a different thing from this. This this other thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. she made it then. I think she you like animate then. Okay. Did you know? Did you know the voice of Invader Zim is the voice of Raz yeah. Putin in Psychonauts, and in Psycho in Psychonauts two, you have this ability called mental projection where you make a two D clone of yourself, and then the voice of the two D clone is the voice of Gur. So it's like a reunion. Uh, it's like a mini reunion. It was really they cute. They start oh, blowing each other. Yeah, they start <laughs> blowing each other. It was nice. Technically, yeah. it's masturbation because yeah. that's his clone. Uh, it's a literal uh, mind fuck. Yeah, exactly. Off topic, off topic. I am so. I wanted to get your Nickelodeon All Stars Brawl game. It's garbage, oh. though, dude. No, I hear it's good, like for a brawl game. No, but the problem, it doesn't have any voice acting. I'm gonna yeah. try to wait pag wala pag may voice acting. It seems so odd to me. I mean, yeah, that, that I get why it was difficult. I mean, obviously, if you get a sound alike and they don't sound exactly like them, people are gonna, you know, I don't know, people are gonna riot. I don't know, but like they've been they've been doing that movie. though. From that's the, true. From the game, from whatever. I don't know. There was this old PlayStation One game that's also on PC. I used to play called Nicktoons Party Blast, where it's yeah, it's all the Nicktoons and it's a bunch of series of mini the, games. I hate the name. Party Blast. Party, Party Blast sounds party. like a rape threat. Yeah. It sounds like a sex tape. Yeah. Yeah. But it they used yeah these clips from uh, from the show like in, interspersed throughout the game they could have done that you're right. Yeah, it's it's just mm. oh, it's a, it suddenly became cheap Sahan, when they said the panel it doesn't have sounds like oh well, I'm thing- not, I'm gonna I'm gonna main see Nigel Thornberry in his gun and he's not gonna say Elijah Nigel Thor- oh wait he died Smashing. or he's sick no he's alive Tim Curry is alive yeah. You know, as I, as I grew, I grew older, pare. Yung sa the wild thornberries, I kind of felt talaga for yung yung si Debbie ba yung yung ate. Yes, yes, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. so you're awesome. you're a fucking hot teen, pare, and fucking yeah. the fucking loser parents drag you, pare, in this wild nature thing. You know what? She was right all along. <laughs> I, I could understand you, para, when you were a kid, na para, why doesn't that Eliza have her adventure? Why you gotta be a wet blanket? Pero like, si Debbie is like. I just want to buy CDs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah and also, yeah, it's probably detrimental to her social life. She doesn't have any yeah. friends because she keeps yeah. moving everywhere. Well, at least you can talk to animals, too, but I can't exactly. hear them. I can't, I can't do yeah. shit. The, the internet talk, didn't yeah. exist at the time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She can't do anything. Um, speaking of uh, mental health and depression, uh, I don't know if this was healthy. Uh, at the start of the pandemic, I started trying to do stand up on the balcony, ng condo. I was just screaming jokes on the balcony. That sounds that nice. Was, that was fun. That's, that sounds like network. When you see the guy says, "If I scream at the top of your nose, I'm I'm tired. I, I'm not gonna take it anymore." And see, Adrian just decides to uh, dick jokes and he's screaming into the ether. <laughs> yeah. I, I I get that. I wish I had a balcony to scream at. Um, did anyone laugh? No, the joke. Um, the the people who watched the post, like I was on say some post, sabi ni Reda. Akala ko tatalon ka na eh. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm not sure if this is healthy, pero na tatawa ako. <laughs> Wait, okay. I mean, I'm oh, sorry, sorry. Go go. I was gonna say. I mean, if you can laugh at like your own pain, I guess that's fine. I don't know. It, it, either that's a defense mechanism or I don't know. But hey. You know, River, how much money I have made making fun of my mental illness, but it rules that all <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, that's not, that's that's not a right uh, mentality. No, that's uh, um, 
easy lang PT Anderson. That's like a fucking line from like Boogie Nights or so. I don't know. <laughs> you know Where how you much. Know you know how story. much money I made making Speaking... comic books about my sadness <laughs> around a hundred pesos. I don't know. To what River said, like, naalala ko tuloy doon sa sinabi yung laughing at your pain. May pare na punta sa USD second year. First year pa ako, first year pa ako, nasa bio, BS Bio. Tapos may nag-talk yung pare dun sa harap ng um, new med building. May yung med building na may auditorium. Sa auditorium. main building, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a med building, sorry. Never... Sa med building, hindi sa main building. Uh, tapos, nag-speech yung pare. Kaya siya nag I love you parati sa nanay niya kasi yung tatay niya, yung tough love, tough love. Tapos dumating sa point na nabangga yung tatay niya sa isang puno. Tapos... Oh, he made the joke, not me. Tangi na, dalawa pa tayo pare, yung puno, yung puno, tas yung tatay ko. Ang 50-50 pa yung Revo namin. <laughs> That made me laugh so hard. Pero yung main point niya is say I love you every time because you don't know what gonna fucking happen. Uh, yeah, and yeah, that yeah. kind of stuck with me. Na. I, that's why I always say I love you to my sisters and brothers. Even though, you know, I seem kind of detached. But yeah, that's... that's, that's I think that's a healthy way to do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But what made me laugh that it was a joke. Like, God damn. That was a great joke, mister. Can I steal that? 50-50 yung Revo. Sa kulang ng dalong gulong. Hindi. Ang point niya, nabuhay pa nila. Naayos pa nila yung Revo. Yung puno namatay, yung tatay niya namatay. Why would you wanna... I mean, alam po magtipid, pero like it's kind of fucked up na... You would ever want to ride in like the car na from what I But your father you. died then, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, kasi yun yung nung na na total yung aming light light ace. Hindi naman na oh, it to completely total this. So para we didn't try to resurrect it. Hindi hindi daw ko hindi completely total niya sa kanya kasi ang nangyari yung nabangga, nabangga lang yung engine. Tapos tumalsik yung tatay niya sa windshield. Nilinis lang nila yung ano, hindi ko. <laughs> Nagulo lang siya sa windshield. <laughs> It's fucked up, dude. Oh, 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 I, mean, I get that. Ganun. I guess you think you know, idea, the central thought behind there is, I know, um, take care of your things. Um, <laughs> the central thought yeah. is to get car insurance. Yeah, central thought, buddy. Don't be a pussy and be a fucking dumb driver. Go to the left lane, but Wear a seatbelt, yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, I wanna I wanna ask you. This is this isn't about uh, mental health, but I wanna ask you, and and you should chime in, River. Um, I should. So you talked Kitchell Jock, and you said uh, he has a big dick. Yeah. Tell us Here's more. the context. Here's the yes. context of that. Because there are haters of Kitchell Jock, na oh, sir, sab nila malaki ng ipin mo. So me and Red made the bit na yung mga rebuttals, yung mga clapbacks ni Kitchell Jock no sa mga haters niya. So ang sinabi ko, oh, malaki ng ipin ko. Well, kasi ang laki rin ng titi ko, bitch. Tapos sinabi ko yun sa harap niya. And I feel so proud of myself. Did he laugh? Oh, well, he must have laughed. Yeah, he did. He did. He did. Parang yung, ah, may sinabi si Joke na Red na, dude, I can't believe the balls of Red to say this. Na sinabi niya, oh, yung t- at least yung ngipin ko, hindi siya nagnakaw ng 67 billion tulad ng PhilHealth. <laughs> Tapos may sinabi rin sa Joke, ah, at least yung ngipin ko walang braces. Nagawa sa fake medals ng tatay ni Bongo. Kasi fake war he wrote up. That was yeah. fucking good. Jesus. Those are lower blows. Yeah, I didn't have the balls to say that joke. But, oh my God, I can't say that. Ang ganda kong ano, biglang dinadefend na ni Chell Joke na yung mga taong pinagtitrip pa ni Red. Kasi ba't to- low blow na? Sobra na! Oh, no. <laughs> Patay na nga eh. Patay na nga eh. Grabe naman to. Respect the dead. We also made some... I, I, saw, wait, I saw yung meme. Kasi panay pink, right? Tapos yung bangkay ni Marcos, sobrang pink. Tapos let Lenny lead. Oh man, this is a fucking... That's funny. That's this is funny. a fun joke. That's a fun joke. I cannot oh believe that I really put that fucking dead body. Like, like sobra, it's so ugly. Yeah. <laughs> anyway... Dude, he looked like a salamander. See, for did, you, did you know that? No, he he kind of he was instrumental in setting back the games industry in the Philippines by banning. Ferdinand Marcos. Yeah. Banning oh, what? Video games. Re- oh, gonna, freak- oh, okay. Gonna, this is why we're always a generation behind. I get it. Oh. Yeah. Jesus. Okay. 
So do we have to thank him for making the reason why we made this podcast? Is it like is if he? I don't know. Never mind. <laughs> we went too what deep. Yeah, never mind. Uh, Marcos got buried. Marcos got buried like he the only mga games ng ET. They just buried it. <laughs> I remember that. I wish they would bury his face. <laughs> I, I I can't believe they just let his purple ass just like be presented like that. It's so yeah. weird. Did he look like he was a plant of the apes? Yung kay Mark Wahlberg, yung orangutan. <laughs> yeah. Like his face Damn, got so apes. bloated. Have you ever seen an orangutan in real life? Like a huge no. orangutan. They're huge. Like they're bigger than the fattest person you've ever seen. I'm I'm swearing. They're huge. They're scary. Like, How, why do orangutans' faces become a bowl? How does that yeah. happen? <laughs> it's kind of like with cats. Yung face shield, secondary characteristic. <laughs> I'm not they have face shields. They have built-in face shields. I know. I get no, what you mean. That's that's what they. That's what it's called. New face. I know. Face, I will, jowls. I'm just like, thinking of you, like. Do you have like a cat that you never neutered? Like you, you neutered after like mag magig siyang full grown cat. Oh, okay. Your job. You mean, yeah. There's like that thing. Pero if you neuter it before, wala hindi wala. It's like a it's like pubic hair or something. Oh, okay. But I don't know when you orangutan. It's what's the evolutionary reason for that? Do they can they hear better? Because can they see better? Because their eyes are shaded. I don't want to... scares the fuck out of people. I don't know. Orangutans are ugly. <laughs> oh no! Seems to remember disappeared. What are your thoughts on orangutans, Andrew? I don't know, but they seem like they seem like the retards of the monkey kingdom. Not that much. Came back, came back to say, uh, you know, I think I, I, I just saw yeah. an yeah. orangutan in real life, but I just got scared because they're huge. Yeah, they sure are. I watched Space Jam. The first one, the second one. Your, 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 uh, one, one, three. Um, no, I watched the second one, where I had to stop in the middle of it. Um. I like then this is Sarah Silverman and a bunch of other comedians I like. Ew, was she there? Yeah, she was there. there. Sarah Silverman. She's like she's like, like in foil, isn't it? Um, well, yeah, she's like an exec. She plays one of those people. Pero um, I think si LeBron is too much of a good actor. And like I'm saying na kasi si See, Michael Jordan is kind of like a. He's not unlikable, but he's not. See, LeBron comes off as an asshole, so I would rather see him in like an actual asshole role instead of like the hero. Like I mm. thought that he was gonna beat your child, yeah. So, okay. <laughs> but I thought that was gonna be your turn. Up, you're not going to programming camp. You're gonna go to, to no, this basketball camp, or I'm gonna beat you with a switch. Gonna. Okay, again, it's a bit. Pinalo niyo yung neck around the yung court, parang yung sa Goodfellas, yung Maurice Wiggs. I just, I just don't buy a central premise na parang he wouldn't let his child go to programming camp. He's a millionaire. He's not. He doesn't want the kid to go to the basketball. Um, well, apparently, like, that's, he's, that's he's, based on real life too. He has a son that is a streamer. He's, he has a son that's a Twitch streamer, and he doesn't play basketball. And he's very ashamed of his son, yeah. So like he made no. It's I guess it's him learning to not be ashamed of his son. I, I guess that's just the theory that I have. I want. I. I um, Ganda, who's the lady who played your wife? Now? Is it the girl from a uh, no? From Orange? From the Walking the Dead. Oh, no, yeah, she's from Walking Dead. Show, yeah. Um, River, I want. I always wanted to ask this because, um, the dynamic of gaming gamers, BM just old, are the old boomers on their way out, and you are the future. <laughs> so I always wanted to ask you, like, sorry, sorry, you actually break some stereotypes. Now you're not not that. Oh, <laughs> again, so from simple-minded ko na, pero oh, ito yung stereotypes sa 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 online eh. Like, I I think you proved them wrong na. You still laugh at fucking dank shit, weird, like offensive <laughs> shit. Like, do you have like what? Like you know all, what it is? All, all Gen Zers aren't like that, no man. But like, I think the worst representation of you guys are the loudest 
stupid ones online. You know what it is? It's because I live in the Philippines and we're always a generation behind. So I feel like millennials behave like boomers and then Gen Zers behave like millennials and so on. It's like we're all set back a generation. So like right now, I, I get that I technically, I'm, I'm in a weird spot where I'm technically between millennial and Gen Z. It's in that weird hole. Yeah. But I feel and more millennial. And are technically in a place where millennials and boomers. Like yeah. In the old way That's why I always it. find it so funny when like, I mean, nothing against Red, but like he has a bunch of jokes where he's like, oh, you these millennials, am I right? Like he, he used to do that back in Moe's. And I'm like, isn't he a millennial though? That's, that's all that was in my head. Yeah. But I, 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 it's a funny thing. I, I get what I uh, know, what you're saying though. I, I just think it's strange when. <laughs> like he, your, sp- your your generation isn't that easily offended, That's what I'm oh, trying wow. to say. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, you know what? It is? I think it's white people. It's white people that are the ones that are more offended. But okay. I don't know. It's, no, you know what it is? It's rich Filipino kids that like really grew up in like, I don't know. I I can't I can't really, say like it really depends then with social status. Yeah, so like there that's are true. People, like I don't know, it's like it's class war thing. Like I I know some people my age are are very what you're talking about they're easily offended and stuff. Ganon. Pero ganon. I guess your rappers yeah. a real dirt bag then. That's Maybe I'm just a real piece of shit. You know. <laughs> Maybe I'm just no. I I you I I feel like it's funny though. Like you said. Ow. A lot of um, the the people that get offended easily, are, ironically, are like older people. I noticed. Like, if you make fun of someone's like basketball team, you get you get the the shit kicked out of you or something. I don't know. Like, you, I agree. I can't yeah. agree. Namas fragile yung egos ng older people. No, I th- I think everyone is. I uh, know. I think. I think there's. Um, because well, yeah. Well, I think so people focus on young people a lot, so they report on them a lot too. Because like, what's new with like an old person getting offended? But like, if like a bunch of uh, woke tweets uh, get offended, that's yeah. more of like a clickbaity yeah. thing. That's more news, right? Uh, yeah, because these are yeah. the the very same tweens that will be clicking on that article to be like, "No, I'm not offended." And no, they click on it's the, not the tweens. It's the old people who'd click, oh, for, who'd right, reshare it. But... They're like, "Right, I was right." They are. They do get. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And, yeah, yeah. And not completely related. Yung isa on tito na talagang tito tito na parang ano may mga meme na parang front facing camera na parang pag nabuksan yung camera tapos pangit yung yung th- madaming thumb picture sa kanyang yeah. phone kasi he doesn't know how to work yung phone niya. Tapos I, I, I saw him like share like a picture of like a pretty lady yung nakabikini once. Tapos like wala siyang dilagay anything. It's just I like this picture of this lady, young lady ganun. Tapos parang ganun typical tito. So I was sobrang gusto ko yung vibe niya. And then like share siya yung Marcos stuff na parang Marcos pa rin yung pinakamagaling na na the president of the Philippines is parang I wanted to comment using yung aking mom's Facebook. <laughs> this is the new version ay, of using ay, your mom's sabi, credit card. Ay, lalagay ko para sabi ni sabi ng tiyo lito mo na wag ka ganyan, hindi to na yan. And then I actually commented it na and then I deleted it kasi just parang I can't fucking I, I can't give a shit about this kasi like not gonna change. <laughs> yeah, because I, I brought up a point. Then, uh, yeah, that's why I asked this. Because I, ayoko yung, ayoko yung maging katulad ng mga magkurang. Oh fuck the younger generation. I would be like that. Mm-hmm. But I'm like, yeah, you can find irritating things the younger and the older generation, man. Like, that's why I'm never gonna be for togetherness. Because this brought this, uh, this thing has been brought up before. Like, uh, sabi nila, all the way back to Jesus. Martin Luther King, um, Malcolm X, fucking Mahat, AC Gandhi, <laughs> buddy. 2,000 years of our Jesus, Malcolm X. <laughs> yeah, pero, yung point ko, see, uh, see Abraham Lincoln, when they said, oh, fuck that other generation, buddy, they lived a wonderful life. But the moment that they said, let's be together, let's accept each other's differences, you know similar thing that happened to them? They all They all were killed. <laughs> they all were killed. So I will never be for togetherness. So, I don't so you don't that. die. So you live forever. Yeah. yeah. yeah so I live forever. <laughs> That's such a shitty fucking thing. 
dude. I will never be a martyr for change. Yeah, um, dude, because I'm not that into, I'm not that smart. I mean, to you be say the that. But what if one day you say like a really progressive joke in your balcony, and then someone shoots you? <laughs> not you have GB. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm what gonna... a weird, what a weird situation about a. He gets assassinated for a goddamn joke on a yeah. balcony by another yeah. comedian. And then see GBT, he gets a kind of a, I guess, the kill talaga. <laughs> That's why he I, slayed I would, them. I would love to see talaga a debate between an older person and a younger person. That would be great, actually. Oh, put to sa bahay ko. Put to sa bahay ko. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, you want to have dementia. Okay, come in on mom for his my dad. Uh, I mean, the point. Wouldn't that be great, guys? No. Oh man, but who would moderate? Who would moderate? Who would be the one? To, um, he, he... Yeah, no, you, actually, here's what you do. The moderator do. controls the narrative. Eh, in that, that's true. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. gotta get someone. That's why they got. That's why they got. I uh, know. Um, what's his freaking name? The Martian in Looney Tunes. That's why he was the referee. Um, you make me so Matt angry, Damon. that guy. Mar- Marvin yeah, Matt the Martian. Damon. Marvin that's the Martian. Good, that's a good yeah. Matt Damon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, like why they got him because he was part alien, part Looney Tunes, so he was able to mediate properly. You know why he's a good, he's good sa ba, sa Looney Tunes sa three pointers. See si Marvin why? the Martian, he's black. <laughs> yeah, he got I'm a big kinda, dick, pare, and he I'm does. I'm disappointed. Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, what else? What else? Okay, last last yeah. thoughts. Um. What's uh wait uh here? What's your favorite game that involves mental illness? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> yeah. so he's gonna say, I'm gonna guess. Oh, okay, it's game. I'm gonna guess what you guys are gonna say. See, River is going gonna... to say Disco Elysium, and then see Andrew is uh... gonna say Persona Three. I was actually, I was actually gonna say Psychonauts, but Disco Elysium uh-huh. is a close second. Disco Elysium okay. is a close second. There's a well, moment. It, 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 oh, sorry, go. But you can guess Okay, go. I, I'm trying. I don't. This sounds kind of a wild card. I don't, I'm not sure like which I'm one. Say Tony Hawk. <laughs> Tony Hawk was good. Uh, but yeah, there's this moment in Psychonauts. Uh, the f- uh, wait. Do I talk about the first one or the second one? I mean, no. Let's talk about the second one. I'll try not to be too spoilery. But there's this guy who's struggling with alcoholism, right? No. So when you go in his mind. Um, his loved ones are in separate faraway islands and then the ocean that separates them is made of uh, alcohol. It's like bottles of, of gin and whatever. That's And it's like metaphorical and then like um, you know, literal, like the alcohol is, is separating like, him. Is it like pirates themed? The pattern there, you collect maps inside of the bottles? Yeah, you go inside the bottles and you then like- you try to smash each bottle so it stops pouring the alcohol. And so in his mind, you're connecting these islands. You're and then when when the water drains, you realize it's not, you're not on separate islands. You're all in one land mass, and it, the the alcohol was just making it appear that you were separate, but really you were together this whole time and all this stuff. And I like I like that. It doesn't make it now uh, you can cure alcoholism or whatever. Whatever. I mean, you can surely you can you can overcome it, but that's only when you realize that you're not doing it by yourself like that. And I like how they they depicted it that way. Instead of making it like, oh, Raz cured this man of alcoholism. Isn't that great? <laughs> no, like throughout the game, Raz is, doesn't really cure people. He doesn't. He he, he like helps them is fix like themselves. A, is there like a no? Does Raz like cure someone's gayness or something? And yeah, he 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 prays the gay away for. <laughs> oh, or, you know what? You know something. Um, Jack Black's character is gay in in the game, and it's pretty it's pretty powerful how they how they show it. Um, it's his whole like rock he sucking cock. He starts sucking cock on stage. I'm, just, I'm sorry. <laughs> I I really I don't get to joke around Dito, so like it's just, no, I it's okay. Like, oh, I see. Okay. And anyway, so he's yeah. a cool gay character. Yeah, because he's a Viking, and I like that they made him gay because he's a Viking. Oh, I mean, you know. Oh you yeah, that makes that. sense. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, good. That's that's one of my favorite depictions, at least. Was no, I right, guess. Andren? Was it personal? Yeah, you were. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there was this um, story between uh, yung, this is a persona, ni persona three, actually persona four. 
So Persona 4, there's this detective named Dojima. Oh, Persona has... 5 is the shitty one. Persona 4 is the cool one. Okay. And she had this daughter named Nanako. And what happens in the wife of Dojima is um, namatay sa hit and run yung asawa niya, basically. And throughout the the story, he's try- he keeps trying to find his wife's killer. And as the story progresses, he neglect na si Nanako because like he, she she <laughs> She died of poisoning. Di siya pumunta sa hospital. Sinandun siya sa, sa police station niya looking for the killer. There's this one na hindi siya pumunta sa take your daughter to work day. Sinandun parati. Like, and basically yung nayak talaga ako yung part na yun. Like, parang he was so focused on the past mm. that he forgot what the future could bring. And like, God damn. That's, That's that great. Kinda, that kind of hit hard. Bad. Why doesn't Persona 5 do that? <laughs> yeah, no, right? Oh, yeah. Suck dick, dude. It would suck if they did that and they started doing that every uh, parang, parang Far Cry. If you Far Cry Persona 5. <laughs> it's, the, it's diminishing returns. When you, yeah. Well, they're all, they already kind of do that naman with each uh, ano, um, yeah. I'll, I'll say yung akin. Uh, I think like a powerful Thing, say some video game was what's that fucking platformer na about Celeste? Celeste. Limbo? Uh, yes. I was gonna Celeste yes, was my third. Limbo. Place. So we started like, another hour of fighting about Limbo. <laughs> trying to defend a game that I didn't love. Um, no, no, I played uh, Celeste. Celeste there's just is this great. Part, okay. There's just this part na ano, um, because it's, it's about depression uh, and it's about uh, transitioning then. You know? and just In general, it's about finding yourself. But like, there's this part that it teaches you how to do breathing exercises during a panic attack. Mm, and yes, they just yeah. did it so perfectly that parang they simulated your panic attack, first of all, which fucking got me bothered. Parang I'm having a panic attack right now. And then they helped you get through it like in a mini-game fashion. And then it's not like press F to pay respects. It's more like, oh, like I I was in a completely different uh, space. Like it, that's such a weird thing because in a video game, na parang it a video game doesn't really put you in someone else's shoes so much as con- lets you control someone else, mm-hmm. right? But like I feel like dito sa Celeste, I saw through someone else's uh, experience. Gonna, I was I was just thinking about this when I was playing this uh, this game Alien Isolation na parang um you know the problem with games na parang is you really don't know where to go because you're not the character you know you don't live uh, in that world so yes. it's like what has to happen is like oh this fucking item is glowing Ganon. and I was trying to think of how do you solve this thing and it's like I guess you have to have like narration that's why you um Something like Stanley Parable worked because it can just fed you what mm. you, your character was saying. So anyway, yung, yung Celeste really, really got to me. Na parang, it's such a... And like I could tell you a story in Celeste, but I think it's like, it's not a story worth telling. It's a story worth experiencing. Why? Yeah. yeah. It, it kinda, oh, you need to play the oh, game. Yeah. yeah, it's like, oh, what are your story? She just fucking climbs a mountain and she hangs out with like a black dude. For some reason, <laughs> like it really is just that. Like, yeah. Again, and then she sees like a grandma, and but it's like this vibe. Eh? There's like this a lot of, like every part that you go through is like, there's a go- guy, who's creepy. I know. It's like I'll, I I I want to talk about one moment in, in Celeste that 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 uh, touched me, and I like that part. It's the feather, right? The the yeah. When she's having a panic attack, you have to press the jump button to float a feather just right so you're breathing properly. It was really powerful, but there's this one moment that really got me in Celeste. And and even the beautiful thing about Celeste, even if I spoil it, it doesn't matter because when you play it yourself, you're really gonna feel something. Cause the the yeah, obviously the mountain called Celeste Sorry, is like I just know, had a flash but... of the Android throwing a controller nya and then talking to PS4. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hard game too. Yeah, that's, that's, that's why I'm curious because again, coming from me, I thought this was just a fucking awesome platform i didn't know my deep shit 
I didn't know fucking. I didn't know either. I thought I was yeah. like I'm, gonna, I'm in yeah. like a super meat boy fucking yeah. situation. No, same. Yeah, I was like, oh, you get strawberries. It's cute. But yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, there's this part where because the mountain is supposed to represent like a struggle. It could be depression. It could be whatever challenge you're facing. She goes near the top, but then she falls off the mountain, and it's like supposed to um, depict like relapsing. Um, when you make, you know, you regress, whether it's a mental illness or an issue you're trying to get over. But then it's supposed to show that that's part of the journey. So what happens, she regresses, she falls off the mountain and she goes deeper, lower than she's ever been in her lowest point. But because she's in the lowest point, she's able to, she realizes when she goes through the steps again up the mountain, you unlock a, an extra jump. So even though you're going through the same obstacles yeah. again, because you went through what you've been through, you're actually stronger for it. So when she went through the same obstacles through the mountain, you have like a third extra jump. So you're you're actually you get through it much faster, and you're back to where you are, but you're better, you're stronger. That that part was really cool because they showed it through the yeah. gameplay. They didn't yeah, just say, awesome. yeah, they didn't just, just say, no, no, you're better now. <laughs> just to relate to like uh, AA stuff, um, I I was, um. I'm part of like recovery groups of the Facebook stuff. So it's, it's there's a lot of memes and it's funny. But like, uh, I read somewhere, I, I can't remember exactly, but um, the thing about relapsing though is like, if you get sober once, um, that's fine. Ganon. And then if you relapse, that's the real uh, journey. Kasi parang, can you, you've proven to yourself that you can get sober once. Yeah. But maybe you relapse and that's the only time they can get sober. That's the only I know. But if you get sober again, that proves to you that you can do it over and over again. And I'm just relating it to to, to Celeste. Yeah. Ganun. Yeah, yeah. So like in yung in yung naramdam ako with like with like health and like uh, uh fitness na I experienced. But I was fat before. I got thin, and it's like I did it again, and I did it in a healthier way now. So it's like. Um, I guess I'm just gonna get obese right now because I know I can always get back. Yeah, because you know you but, can always. <laughs> I always have time. Um, but yeah, that's uh, I, I yeah. like Celeste. There's a lot. Of, I love Celeste. It was very. It deserved. Heart. Yeah, it deserved the awards it got. Like, I, can I say we're going too long? It's okay if it, I, it's, it's, it's just okay. Let's just go. Kung, however, um, yeah, yeah. Go it's, river, it's, uh, yeah, the it's best because because it was a Celeste. It's more subtle. And fuck, dude, I, I need to download that game. Yeah, it's great. Like, in, in other ways, na yung spirit fair must in your face, yeah, in a way. Yeah. Kasi yung, yung story ng bull, plus nung um, bird, plus yung, kasi yung past life nila, but they were robbers. Plus, yeah. hindi accept the, it's a brain dead na. Gano na reveal, kasi when you talk to the ox, like, he doesn't say anything, and the bird is speaking for him, and that just, brotherly love and that just fucking fucked me up dude in part man that's why i love that game so much even can though I, can i be real about it right now like yeah um i've been thinking about spirit there and i think it's a good it's, i think i know it's a great game i played yeah, it, it is. And, and i i, I really want to finish it then someday but it's just it hurts me to play it eh? Cause I yeah it is it is a yeah, sad yeah. No, no, no no it's not that Sino yung, ano yung name ng character? I forgot, pero like yung bull, tas yung, yung bird. No, no, yung main, main girl. The main, main character? Main uh, character. Starts with S. S. I forgot her name. Yes. Oh, no. Sharon? Sydney. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah Sharon. Sharon. Oh. Yeah. I just, I feel bad playing as her because she's infinitely kind and can spend time with old yeah. people. Yeah. And she doesn't get mad. And then the game, I can't do that. I get so frustrated to parents when taking care of them. And it's Stella, like, that's her name. Sorry, I just found Stella. In, yeah. Uh, it's just, yeah, but I'm sorry. Stella represents Sharon, yung yeah. with them yeah. dead people. Because he, so, he retired, yeah. right? So mm-hmm. it's like playing that game like hits me so, on such a different level. Because it's like, oh, I'm being nice to old people. I'm being, I'm fucking feeding them popcorn, getting them whatever. And like I can see like the little thing going up. And then like, but that's the thing, eh? like I'm in that situation. I'm taking care of like old people, and it's so thankless. Yeah. And it's mm. like it gets 
And I'm 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 honestly super burnt out right now about it. And I get mad because mm-hmm. I don't want to do it if I start just resenting them. And I think because it, it's unfair to them and it's unfair to me. And then and, and like because I can't. In la, in na isip ko ganon. Like my experience here is less spirit fair, more death stranding. But <laughs> <laughs> um. Since Giselle never finished the game, the ending, actually, if you choose to end it, like, you die in the end, like, you, after helping all of these That's people. That's the real? Okay, so it's fine. I want, I want to know then. Uh, maybe if I know more, I'll play it. Then, then yeah. And you just, yeah. there's the option to accept. Uh, oh, you want to go rent to the next life? And actually, you ending, because what, what made it hit so hard It wasn't like this over mel- melodramatic thing. Literally, you just last Romo, so was mm. yung yung pet motors in them, and you just look at the white light, and you hug the your pet, and you just go through the door, and it just closes. I don't do that. Just that fucking sucks. You don't have a mini game. <laughs> <laughs> What a What a rhythm part. <laughs> I just love na yung it didn't. Yeah. I don't I don't wanna I'm just thinking of yung parang may mga ganong quiet moments, right? But you as the play you start jumping around. <laughs> I do love oh. that in the game, just like with all the other characters, it asks you if you want to accept yes. your your oh, end. Okay. So it treats you the game treats you the same way you were treating the NPCs. No, no. You wait for them to make the decision to finish yeah. their journey. So you have to choose to end it if you want to finish the game. That's so interesting. It's it might be the first game that actually teaches you how to accept death. Yes, yes. Mm. And games kill you all the time. And yeah, it no. really, And the, the the way that it that the, you die in games, it makes death that a factor. You know, Giselle, that, don't give don't give this great game that much credit because after you go through the door. As it closes, my love of us, you died, buddy. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's not. It's oh, that'd be so freaking funny. Ang ganda, ang ganda ko <laughs> ano, bigla ano, para oh, so you're awake, tapos you're in a car, tapos you're in Skyrim. Skyrim. <laughs> you're finally awake. <laughs> yeah. So like, I think oh, I'll just, I'll just, ano, I'll just end it, and then pero like, I was thinking about you know, the idea of games as escape. From like a, a bad situation, that was parang like yeah, you know, yesterday I was playing Pokemon Unite with my with my very good friends Ed, and um, we we're playing on Discord. You know, he was playing on his phone, I was playing on my Switch. I was like, I was having such a good time, you know, and it's just parang it's a good game. It's a, yeah. it's, a it's a baby's MOBA. Baby's first MOBA. That's I've I've been getting those experiences too. Honestly, there's two escapes for me when it comes to video games and this is why i really enjoyed spirit fair then and that i love that the main character doesn't talk or doesn't it rarely makes a sound and i, I get what you're saying just earlier about how like the main character is so kind and whatnot but like you also have to remember that the main character doesn't say a word so all the thoughts and the feelings that you were feeling are the feelings of the main character i think that was the goal so, so i wanted, like, I really want to punch you man. yeah <laughs> if you really yeah exactly i i'm like I, that's what I noticed. Like for me, like the games that I normally escaped, or either it has to be multiplayer where I'm playing with other people, like with my cousin and my brother. We're like we're playing Pokemon Unite too, and we're playing Halo every other night, like stuff like that. Or it has to be a game where the main character barely has a personality or they're silent. So that's why I've been gravitating towards JRPGs lately, because I can't I can't seem to push through games with a story and the main character has so much personality. And and that's I'm not saying it's a bad thing. But I just, I don't know. I can't, I can't shoulder playing someone else. I, I want to feel like I'm the one accomplishing it. So I guess that's why yeah, I've been you, playing a lot of you, you want to have this sense of control. Buddy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. That's why I really like. I got Doom because I'm like, I want to kill demons. I want to do that. And like, you know, with Shin Megami, like, I want to tame demons. I guess it's the same thing. I want to fuck like demons. That. I want to. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no. Hey, that's just me though. Like, I guess I, that's I, why. I have a gaming question. I have. Do you feel like you've ruined yourself for the new Shin Megami Tensei? That's why I'm, I'm. I'm saving myself. I'm giving myself space because it's coming out in November 11. So that's more than a month from now. I can't. So I'm really. I, I, I don't think it'll be that different. 
to, to be honest. Oh, by say, the way, Metroid Dread, um, there's reviews now. How are you gonna get it? Like it, it looks fantastic. Yeah, uh, I, I think I have some money, a significant amount of money coming in. So it's like, oh, like I, I don't feel bad. But I'm play, I'm playing through Alien Isolation now. Okay. Like, I, I decided that I, 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 I feel like I progressed as a human being because I said, na, oh, I said like I said I'm not, I'm, I don't need to play this on like a, a hard difficulty or like a normal uh, difficulty. I could just play novice and not really give a shit about crawling because I I hate. I love I love you game, but like I just I couldn't get through your stealth stuff, and it's so hard. That, that's any game, yourself, dude. Stealth, yeah, stealth, I mean, stealth, like stealth they parts stop, stink. They, they did that in Nino Kuni too. too. What the fuck are you no, doing? No, no, because no. it's the the whole game is being stalked by an alien, and I was just being stalked by people. Just para hit up, hit up now. So it's like I'm gonna make it easier. So I just enjoy your story. I feel like that's a big moment for anyone who plays games. The moment where you're like, you know, I can do easy mode and not have to prove anything. Because I did that. I did that in the last Shin Megami game I played, um, Strange Journey. The final boss is such bullshit. Because in in like most like Persona and Shin Megami games, when you fight an enemy, they have weaknesses and whatnot and resistances. And, like this boss had no weakness, no resistance. You can only beat it when you're max level. I was like, this is so stupid. What did I? I hate when a boss doesn't feel like a culmination of all your experiences, when it's just you have to like max out your character basically. Like what? That, that's not what the game is about. But I yeah, did that. you do I made it. Like it was easy. That was still so fucking. Oh, uh, yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna yeah, start over in that easy? game. Okay. It's dude, hard. I mean, Doom Eternal is hard. hard game. Yeah, yeah. It's a hard I, game, dude. I'm gonna play it on ultra violence. I feel like I that's a big it. moment, though, where you grow up enough to be like, I don't have to prove anything. I can play this on easy and <laughs> this enjoy is a myself. single player game. No one is watching <laughs> me right now. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. I passed the boards. Oh, you want to hear? You want to hear? Pala something. I, I, I really like Sonic Mania. I keep playing it. I replayed it. Oh yeah, it's a good game. It's a good game. Yeah, I, I like the game. Now. The music is yeah. good. You, 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 where you get to play Puyo Puyo. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't the, like the Metal Sonic machine. as a boss, though. I don't. I don't. I don't think it's good. A good. But boss. I didn't finish it. There. I just bounced after. Same. Puyo, Puyo. I never finished it. Because yeah, it was a Sonic game. <laughs> I got, st- I got yeah. stuck in the boss where there's a robot with a rocket launcher and you're in like a, a city type level. Oh, you have that one to is stupid oh, hard. You have to anyway. hit yung pink rocket. Yung helicopter ba yan? I think so, yeah. I don't yeah. remember. It's I don't I feel like I'm dumb ng the, the Sonic bosses don't feel like real bosses. If you, if you yeah, don't but have yung levels. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. No, it's it's like it doesn't. It's like well, I just realized the Sonic is a pinball game, basically. Like I should. Yeah. Feel like control. Exactly. Tama. Like that's why they made Sonic pinball. He the, he the, wait, wait. It's a pinball game. No. <laughs> but the retro. That's horizontal. Like, yeah. 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 <laughs> it's not. It's not. Well, yeah. I'm, I'm enjoying it. Okay. So that's, that's good. good uh, Let's yeah. leave it off with that. Thank you guys for joining us on Thank Gaming so Gamers. Um, I'll just I'll just plug something to the one person. I don't know. Uh, comics. I have comics on my Facebook. Just tell Nicholas. Let's check it out. Um, Iko Andren, do you have like a show? Um, I am free now. Wala pa ang show. And just watch Bago Matulog with Red. I'm the co-host there. Yes, yeah. Watch the Shell Jokna episode. Um, I guess the only thing I have to plug is Lenny Robredo is running for president, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, vote that's wisely. about it. Yeah, Fuckers. register. I mean, if you can, I was lucky enough to register before the pandemic, so I feel like I dodged a bullet. I use my P. Yeah, I've never voted before, so I'm pretty excited. They all not vote the last election. I just use my yeah. PWD card to fucking shoot. Dude, nice. Fast. Fast fuck. Right. But I'm, I'm, like a <laughs> <laughs> I'm like a depressed Sonic bug the things among a broken <laughs> shit. I just go through that shit. You only have ka. one ring. Go in, go in and get this one. Yeah. And then you, put your hand, you put your hand through your leg, like in the. In like in the... <laughs> oh, no. Yeah.
Okay. Thank you, guys. Uh, next week, we'll Thursdays na po gaming gamers. Thank you. Bye, guys. Bye.